Hello, chat. Hello. Cuties, happy Saturday. I, uh, I, I'm in a good mood today. We're gonna keep that up, hopefully. This is weird. How's it going? Happy Saturday. Chat, we have gotten some computer improvements. I'm freaking hyped. And now I also have three monitors. Chat gets their own monitor. You guys are special. And my lip hurts. Because my cat bit me. That's been like my week. I don't think you can see it on like the camera. Can you see it? Not really. Because I just put stuff on it. Upgrade. Yeah, I got an upgrade. Thanks, Kuth. I got hand-me-downs. Happy Saturday. Yeah, I'm excited. I I want to play Wukong so bad, I can't stop thinking about it. Like, after Wednesday, I was like, oh, man, how am I going to make it to Saturday? Like, I want to play the game now. I want to keep playing. I'm really excited. Because this game is super fun. And I'm very looking forward to it. And on Saturday, we beat... The last boss in chapter one, which the last secret boss of chapter one. And we did parts of chapter two and we still have more of chapter two. We, I know the chapters get longer as the game goes, so I guess we'll see how, how chapter two goes. And then maybe we end up in chapter three today. I don't know. I guess it depends on how much of a god gamer I am today. Am I a god gamer? The answer is yes. The answer is yes, of course. Thought I gotta look at something. And, uh, yeah. I don't wanna stall too long because I really just won't play the game. No stalling today. I'm gonna open it because I wanna wait. No stalling! And the last boss we fought on Wednesday was so good. So good. Okie dokie. <gasps> Talking as 45% feral. Hello, son. You're, you're like kind of calm. I get it. I am. Mega feral. I was 87%. Well, maybe. Hold up a second. How are you doing? I am I'm I have three monitors now, so now I'm trying to make sure I'm looking at like the right places and whatnot. Because chat is over here and everything else is all the way over here. I'm like hope I don't crick my neck or something. You're so chill, it is unmatched, the chillest. All right. I'm, I'm so excited. I'm so excited, I love this game. I love this game. I'm so excited <laughs> because I, yeah. I haven't been able to like stop thinking about this game since Wednesday. The man, the myth, the husband, yeah, and the husband gave me, he just built his new PC and he gave me his, his, his pieces. His pieces? What do I call that? He gave me some of his parts. He's a very kind being. We're gonna go to the Valley of Despair. <laughs> Despair. So we beat the rat guy. Minus one family. Here I am destroying entire families again. The hand-me-down parts. True love. Yeah, he gave me the hand-me-down parts. And the hand-me-down parts spirit, they're like massive upgrades. I love hand-me-downs. <laughs> okay, and how are you doing, spirit? It's good to see you. I need to look at... 
Okay, so we're good. Yeah. Should have given you an AMD GPU so you didn't have to deal with NVIDIA updates. Yucky. NVIDIA updates. Wait a second. This isn't where I wanted to go. Whatever. Some of your parts are pre-owned? Yeah. It's so nice. I, uh, you know, marriage equals computer parts. Kenny is so much better at all that computer stuff than I am. So, like, I just trust him to help me. <laughs> I'm just here to play video games. Oh, Servando's 21%. Hello, Servando. And Spirit is 34. Also, Sha! Hello, cuties. No, you! How are you doing? How's it going, everybody? You beautiful beans. We're... Kenny and I are the only ones feral today. I was 87. Kick that. It went flying. So we fought the final secret boss of chapter... I don't like those noises. Chapter 1. And it was super cool. Can you trust me to help him through DMs? Yeah. <laughs> also give him shit. Do it. What the? Someone just shit at me. Look at this guy. Yuck. Oh, 82! Shaw is feral! Fuck yeah! I really want to hit zero, even if it's even possible. I, I have it set up, so zero should be an option. Yes. But no one's ever gotten zero. May you be the one. Yeah, it goes zero to a hundred. Power supply that came with Cat's pre-built PC was so bad. Yeah. What the fuck are you? Oh! Hey. Holy. Ow. Ooh. Oh, this bat is cool. But now he's dead. Hold on a second. This guy, let me kill him. Brown eyed Aries is zero percent feral. Wait a second. Acton is the bot now? Ow! Let me kill you. How everybody doing? Oh shit, shot. I'm doing great. I'm fabulous. The only thing is my lip. Chat, my cat straight up bit my lip the other day and like ripped a chunk out of it. Because I pulled away. I was cuddling with him when I was going to bed. And sometimes he tries to like lick my face and I pull away because I don't like him licking my face. But you know how cats will like bite when they groom? Cade sometimes likes to try to do that to me and I'm always like, no, please don't bite, it's weird. Well, the other day he went straight in for a bite and he bit my lip and it hurt. So I was like, ow, so I pulled away and now I have my lip is owie. <laughs> it hurts. <laughs> and if I smile too wide, it cracks. It's pain. Wait, is this where I came from? Yeah, it hurt. And it was like late at night too. So I was like, ah, it's too late for this shit, bro. Okay, we have two directions. Let's go this way. Yeah, it really hurt. <laughs> it did not feel very good. <laughs> Did I... Do I have any self-advance? I have one.
It's rough, but it's fine. <gasps> oh! Heal. Ow! They're mean. Ah! Let me heal. Let me heal. I'm gonna die. I, I'm gonna die because I can't heal. Let me heal. Ow! Th these guys are mean. I don't like them. Kill, 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 kill. The bad guys are terrifying. What the hell? <laughs> I can self advance again. Um, let's see. I like the immobilized stuff. Oh, I have to be okay. What are these? Level. Oh, right. Okay. Mmm. I'm gonna save up for another spark and get that one. Then I do more damage after I do a perfect dodge. And I'm really good at perfectly dodging because I'm a professional gamer. Give me this. Celestial Nonary Pill, a miraculous pill refined by Lord Lao from the Tushita Palace that massively increases max stamina. Ooh, my stamina. Put everything into stamina. Oh, this was like a little secret? Or an item. That's it. Cool. Oh. Worth killing those guys then. Okay. This place has so many cute little nooks and crannies. Oh! Crouching Tiger Temple. <gasps> Ooh, I'm excited. I want to go everywhere and nowhere all at once. Hi, Aries! Hello, Queen. How are you doing? What is up? Happy Saturday. We are just chilling. What is this? Immediately increases the damage dealt by all pillar stance moves. Oh. Okay, I like this crit one though. I think I will keep it for now. Why is Acton Sam 0% feral? Because I'm feral. Because, um, Acton is the bot now. And determined what you were. <sighs> Acton was ahead of you. No, we have- no one's ever gotten 0%. People have gotten 1%. Holy shit! 96! I can... Take that, Acton! <laughs> Yeah, no one's ever gotten 0%. Ever. 1%, but never 0. Millennium Ginseng. <laughs> I was close in my guess. Yes, so close. Yeah, you're the most feral person here right now. <laughs> oh. Oh, is this the blood guy? Oh, I'm a little scared. I know there's a boss that's in like a pool of blood. The centipedes. Yeah, and and Aries, good news. I got hand-me-downs from Kenny. Kenny's old computer. It was meditation time. And so now my computer is mega upgraded. So even better streams. Let's go. Huzzah. I'm so excited. 
I'm so excited to be playing this game. Yeah, I went from a, wait, Kenny, what was my RAM before? I went from like a 20 something to a 4070 super. <laughs> Pretty. Time to go kick more ass. Big ballin, yeah. I feel like a champion. Oh, I got two sparks. I got a new power supply, GPU, and RAM. Yeah, Kenny. Well, willingly gave me pieces of his old computer and is now sad because he had to give me pieces of his other computer. Was there an incense burner place here? Yeah, I'm tripping. Cat isn't easily as baited as Kenny. Your name is easy to spell, so I used it. <laughs> yeah, I don't get baited. Ever. Oh, I'm blind? Oh, I did it already. I'm just blind. Whatever. I, that's so funny that you say cat isn't as easily baited as Kenny. That's so funny. Yeah, it's crouching tiger drinking blood. It was, oh, it's feral. Also, thank you for the follow. Oh, yeah, that's right. There's the rats and then the tigers, and they are not getting along very well. Yeah, Tony. Yeah, Tony the Tiger. Hi, Neris Mia. How are you doing? <laughs> I'm gonna beat him up. He's gonna try to eat me! Kung the Kung Fu Panda boss! Oh, okay. That was a little bit slower. Oh! Yikes. Oh, the, the, oh, I didn't rest. So I have no healing. Well, it's over. Hmm, <laughs> yeah. healing <sighs> debatable but pushing on how's the game so far it's been good it's been i have been just so looking forward to coming back to stream and play this game because i love it so much it's so it's just it's just genuinely very fun it's just very fun but he's one of those bosses who really like teaching beginners the game let's say I have heard he is a little tough. He's a tough man. I've seen this little. I've seen this. At least I've seen the arena. Oh! Get him. Ah, I missed. Oh, I did not miss. Mm -hmm. I shouldn't have done that. He definitely won't go down without a fight. Yep. He's angry. And bloodthirsty. Uh, that's got a follow-up. Oh, that's also got a follow-up. Okay. It's got like three follow-ups. Got it. Oh, oh! 
Oh. Oh my god. Okay. Hello. Would you say he is feral? Uh, yeah. Oh. I love his moveset. Oops. His moveset's really fun. Hard boss, and you're you decided you need to beat him before exploring the last chapter. Oh, very nice. Yeah, there's a lot of bosses, and I know that it ramps up in difficulty at some point. The difficulty just ramps up. Ah, oh, this target boss, everyone's getting clapped. By me, a spirit. This is a tiger's boss. Everybody's getting clapped by. Oh, oh, spirit. <laughs> I thought he, you said, like, clapped by me. I was like, oh, you're the tiger? Nothing our cat can't handle. Yeah, I can do it. I've definitely heard this boss is, uh... Hmm. I keep dodging that too early. There's a lot of secret content, yeah. I'm planning on trying to uh, fight all the secret, like all the bosses in this game, so. Hmm. Ah! Oh! Damn. DLC comes out January. Oh, yeah. They did announce the DLC. Supposedly, yeah. I don't think they gave an exact date, but they did say it's coming out. Which is really exciting. I'm excited to see that. <laughs> that was a terrible time to do that. What the? What the? What was that? Was cool. Hmm. That bot. This boss has a lot of moves. What the hell? the song. Oops, I did it again. I rolled too early. Holy shit! Dude! He just keeps coming up with moves! Holy shit, that's crazy. Hmm. 
That do what the oh. <laughs> the longer I fight him, like the more moves he's got. <laughs> uh, some people are saying six more chapters or 12, and if it doubles the gameplay, I don't mind it dropping 40 60 bucks holy shit yeah hopefully it drops like more chapters that would be so fun well that's cool that's a lot of chapters that's like even more <laughs> okay Brittany. <laughs> dude this guy's got a gazillion moves that's crazy Shit. Okay. What? Ah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I was off. Oh, okay. Oh, you little, you little shithead. It's fine. Ouch. Well. Oh! Oh, I couldn't see the second one. You see how big the chapters really are from three on, and two is bigger if you search it all? Yeah, I know that all the chapters just get, like, bigger and bigger and bigger as, like, the game goes on. It's crazy. How much, like, content is in this game. There's just so much cool stuff. It's very, it's very great design. Really fun. <laughs> I love this game. I... Ah, I did it again. She never learns. I'm not going to be tempted. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> 
Hey. Hey now. Oh yeah, it wasn't directed at anyone, just a little pin pin. You're not transforming on purpose? What? Oh. No, I'm I'm transform. I just usually wait until the boss is at like half health before I start trying to do that. Just yeah. <laughs> so I don't um Hikers. Let me back up. No! Oh, I like the move. Want this game? <laughs> Not to tempt you. Ow! But this game is super lit. I I don't know what I was trying to do. I didn't have what I was trying to do, but I kept trying to do it anyway. Yeah, maybe you shouldn't you shouldn't get it. So many games coming out soon, though. You're getting the Dragon Age, right? That comes out soon. I know you're excited about that. Nah, no. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I am throwing. He always has a kick follow up after that. this time. Huh! Come 
heal. Nice try. What? What? But I didn't hit him. Oh well, whatever. You've not heard it. I have heard, heard, I've heard like, um, like mixed things, but about Dragon Age. But like, I think it has some really, I saw like the combat and I was like, combat looks kind of fun. It looks very interesting. And I kind of, I think the style is kind of cute. You keep your expectations low so you can't be disappointed in new games. <laughs> Cyberpunk kind of ruined that pre-hype game. Dude. Cyberpunk was like... So sad. It makes me... I know the game is a lot better now. But like... Ah... Uh, But I still, it just left a bad taste in my mouth. He always has a follow-up cat. Why do you do that? He always has a follow-up cat. He's putting me in the corner. Nerd. Shit. I'm throwing. Ah, oh, fuck. But that's a good thing. I'm having fun. This fight's actually really fun. Some people got stuck with wanting things to never wanting things to never change. It's never gonna be Dragon Age 1 all over again. Yeah, I know some people are like super, super mad about things like changing. Ludrix I'm playing a line about how there can there can't there can be trans people in Dragon's Age. <gasps> really? Sounds like a redneck community. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, what? Why does that... What? What? Do, who does that hurt? It literally hurts nobody. Bunch of weirdos. No, I did it again! She doesn't learn! Ugh! <gasps> 
heal. Hmm. Oh, shit. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> he kicked me. This is the run. No, not this time. Messed up. the transphobes can you just not play the people you don't like problem solved yeah like you don't have to no one's making you sounds like they're just projecting <laughs> how dare you include diversity yeehaw ah. No, there's always a follow-up. When will you learn? When will you learn? <laughs> when will you learn? Oh, Lord. Ah, I was too slow. Let me heal. Yikes. Scared of their leaderboards getting taken over by people they don't like. This fight is super fun. I gotta learn though. I have to learn. I keep getting hit by the same shit. I know the moves. I just need to stop getting hit. the follow-up what okay guess I was late <laughs> no the follow 
follow up. No, I keep being too slow. Follow-ups? I did that totally wrong. Yikes. Uh oh. I'm dead. <laughs> that was unfortunate. Aggressive play style, really making this an action movie. Yeah, I play aggressive and super aggressive. Wanna kill violence. I did the transform and totally botched it completely. That was really bad. That's fine. Close, yeah. I've got this soon. Soon. <laughs> No, follow up. <laughs> nice. Uh oh. No! Yep, I keep doing that. Remembered I'm she's learning shit. I don't like this Shit <sighs> Yeah, I, I deserve that I No <laughs> I tried to dodge. I tried to heal and he punched me in square in the face. Hi, Chef. You beat the game yet? No way. But the game is beating me. This boss is tough. He is, um, he's got a very cool moveset, though. Now that I can, I have seen and I understand, I just have to do now and stop throwing. Mm -hmm. How are you doing? I hope your weekend is going well.
I did it again. I keep just doing it wrong. Ah! Uh. Got him. Woo! Nice! <laughs> that was so fun! <gasps> what a fun fight! New magic or rock solid? <laughs> I am perfect for being rock solid? Yeah! Aries! GG. Thank you for your biddies. That's so kind of you. Thank you. Thank you, Chef. Thank you, Aries, again. Thank you for your, your biddies. And thanks, Kuth. I can solidify the body like a rock to parry incoming attacks. Oh, this is the parry. Oh, I'll be good at this. I can do this. Ooh, fun. That, I liked that fight. He, he, he had me sweating a little bit. How? His henchmen. Right. Right, right. Okay, that's right. He has two henchmen that I have to get talismans from. So I can go do that. There's like a huge secret side quest in chapter two. I know this because I I saw the end of it, but I, I don't know how to get to it, but we'll just see. I will, I'm sure I'll find it. I, I want to just go everywhere. Let me just... Hurts. Wanna look at all the things. Oh chat, we gotta read the lore too. Oh no, it's one of you! Oh hey.
I won and had no health, so I got one shot by a mushroom man. Um, nice. Hold on, let me read. I want to read the lore. Oh, was he a king? <gasps> Tiger Vanguard was a king. Hmm, chat, you ready for lore time? It's lore time. Majestic and grand with a fierce display, striped coat, eyes like lightning's ray. In the blood pool, its wrath does rise with a bronze head it and Iron Tail, it terrifies. Ooh, yes, Tiger Vanguard. What a weird name. The tale begins centuries past, when the journeyers across, across Yellow Wind Ridge. In those days, the old Tiger Vanguard lost his life, seizing the Tong Monk. He left behind two sons, who, once orphaned, had to fend for themselves. Oh. The mountain groves lay in ruin. The Tiger Brothers led the remaining lesser guise in a bitter struggle for survival. Fortunately, their father had taught them enough to make a living. As the sandstorms ebbed, Rock Wise slowly restored the groves to their former state. The elder tiger, following his late father's ways, governed the Yao Guise in the mountain. He knew their place and dared not prowl forth to prey on the living. Later, mortals drawn by the lush peaks and clear springs built a village amid the slopes. The elder tiger gained renown as a deity in the mountain with the principal devour the evil, and shield the good. The villagers built a crouching tiger temple for the brothers, offering rich tribute that made their lives even more blissful. Yet long had the younger nursed a grievance. His elder brother reaped all the glory in people's words on the tigers in the mountain. He believed his brother yearn earned this merely by dint of a few more years of life. Another century turned and the Yellow Wind Sage... Ah! There we go. <laughs> the Yellow Wind Sage returned to Yellow Wind Ridge with a host of Rackwise. The younger tiger declared that it was the sage's negligence that had doomed their father. He clamored to slay the sage in vengeance, urging his brother to drive off the rats. Deeming this just, the elder agreed, but in that fight, the sage unleashed the vessel like a boat of this... What is that? What is that word? What is that? Tva's severed head. Oh, like Buddha's severed head? With its scale sharp as, it, as an edge, in a single clash, the younger tiger fell, grievously wounded. The life of his little brother, the elder tiger at once, cast down his arm and knelt in surrender. The sage held no grudge after learning the brother's origin. He even bestowed upon the surrender the title of Vanguard. When the younger tiger woke and learned his brother now served as the Vanguard, he seethed in disbelief. The brothers quarreled bitterly until he, the younger stormed off, severing all ties with the only family he had left. In the tiger vanguard's eyes, that yellow-furred rat had twice destroyed his family and left them broken and scattered. He hated him for that. He was no fool. As long as the rat had protection from the higher ones, what more could a tiger do beyond venting his rage by devouring a few lesser rats each day? Oh, that's actually kind of sad. How come people... So the, the, the yellow sage seems to be, like, so nice, but, like... Everybody hates him because he's so nice? Question mark. <laughs> I want to be friends with the yellow sage. Although I, I think he might. Something is wrong. So his brother left because he was mad. He was salty. Step away to eat dinner and Tony is no longer doing great. Yes, Acton. How was your food? I hope it was delicious. Did you? I want to know. Ow. I miss. I like that these are like the mimics of the game. They're so funny. Yeah, he was kind of tough, but he was fun. I loved it. I loved that fight. Can I climb up here? No? I'm just trying to go into like every nook and cranny and the game won't let me.
Oh, yeah. I need to put my spell on. Ow. Ow. Hiya. Yeah. Oh. Hey yeah. Whoops, that was overkill. His body like bounced. <laughs> playing this is such a stark difference from how you played bloodborne it's funny to see them back to back well yeah i'm not being a coward you're right is that what you mean listen bloodborne's a horror game Yes, you aren't being a coward. Well, it's because these enemies are easy and make squeezy. Amazing what some sunshine can do. Yeah, it's too scary. Set spells. I want to do this parry. How do I do the parry spell? Oh, rock solid. A defensive spell to transform the caster into a rock. If the enemy strikes upon the rock the transformation they shall be deflected which grants a perfect chance to counterattack. this sm sm spell may seem simple timing is crucial cast it early too late late and it won't work mm. i like this i want to try that rock salad yeah i'm rock solid raw Give, give me my rock solid rock solid can be canceled at will oh moderately reduces the cooldown give me that i don't need to undo anything because i'll never mess up i'm a parry god this looks scary you know this place is whoa this is like deserty, like it's still cute. Yeah, this the sun. The sunlight in a game equals not afraid. Whoa, now. Ow. Hey, I'm trying to live. No more healing. did it i did the parry but then i died because i had no more healing because i spent all my life trying to beat the babies hi pomegranate how's it going welcome back i died but oh, hold on Watch this. 
<laughs> yeah, that's what I wanted. He's dead now. You missed Tony. Yeah, I just barely beat him. What the? Why am I attacking one completely different than the one? There we go. That is how you dodge the shield. <laughs> you parry it. Oh, did Kenny ask how or what? <laughs> oh, I'm I'm Bong Bong. Hey. Hey, you shithead! Hey! Let me kill him! I wanna kill the rat! Thanks. I was being very greedy. This game. <laughs> Aw, I messed up. No, I kept getting hit by it though. Yeah, pretty much the way that you um, dodge the shield is just to um, parry it. What? Yeah, the shield guys suck. <laughs> You're getting your butt kicked by them. <laughs> oh. Ah. Yeah, I, I was getting my butt kicked by the spitting guys, and then he killed me. Dude, the parry is fun. I like it. Hey, bitch. Let me heal. Hold on a second. I am out of magic. I miss you, bitch! <laughs> Ow! What are these guys? I kind of want to read about them because I'm curious. I like and dislike how you can't spam the parry. Yeah, because it's a, it's a, um, it's like a spell. Key item, sobering stone. What? Sobering stone? A foul-scented stone, perfect for sobering up that drunken pig. And what is this? Mysterious gadget found on Tiger Vanguard's body has a strange shape and might be used to unlock a mechanism. Oh. Okay. A drunken pig? Someone's drunk. We're gonna fix it. I'm going to sober them up. This is also where you get the super mega rock transformation. I want that one. That one's so good. Ecom rock. Hey now. might die. I am out of magic. 
Ow. Ow. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> hey, that was rude. I actually don't know what he said. Pillar stance. Oh yeah, I forgot about pillar stance. I find that they're better with like mobs than like other things. Fuck. Ooh, that crit. Wow. I was in, I'm impressed with myself. I mean, there was a crit, but like, wow. Ow. Stop spitting at me. It also feels like in this game, you kind of have to like kill everything even when you die. Because <laughs> some of the enemies, I feel like they follow you far and they're kind of relentless. Yeah, you're not a fan of it either. You want to be able to spam? Yeah, spamming kind of fun. You prefer the stealth move? <laughs> I I came up here already. It's another one of those guys. Let me hit this. Nice try, buddy. Another spark. I am level 29. Nice. Silk. Yay. Okay, maybe I didn't need to kill that guy. So it seems like the people here are like suffering from something and it's making them into weird creatures. I'll find me a place to... I did not mean to... I meant to parry. I meant to parry. Get him. Get him. Yeah. <laughs> I like how you have to do more than just parry everything that can be parried, but at the same time, messing up a parry and having to wait to redeem yourself feels bad. Yeah. That goes for all the spells. Like, if I mess up, like, if uh, an enemy actually, like, dodges out of, like, or, like, manages to, like, get out of my... Um... Ow! Dude, this place is danger. Hold on. If they manage to, like, break out, then yeah, you gotta wait for it to, like, reset, which can kill. Ow. 
Ow. Ooh. <laughs> he bounced. Give me that. Finding pieces of gold. Hiding out. Perfect. So. Okay, I think that's cleared. That's cleared over there. I think we can move forward. Oh no, they're making noises. Almost sent him to North America. Yeah, I hit him very hard. Yikes, I don't like the look of that. Um. Ah! I fucked up. Ah! Hey, you BRB again? Sounds good. Uh, there's a guy! more magic <laughs> okay i'm just gonna try to run back to where this was and try not to fight anything we'll see how that goes deserve that. Shit, that's not good. They just follow me. I don't like that. Yeah, they just follow you. Like, there's nothing I can do. I can't just, like, run through. Their aggro ranges forever. Thanks, bro. What? I can't see. What happened to the enemies? Oh, did he go back? Oh, I guess if he goes too far, he gets sent back. Bitch. Fuck you. Well. <laughs> nice. I have no hails. Oh, oh, one of them is dead though. So one down, two to go. Got him. 
Although, did I miss out on the blue thing because I died? What? I hate he hit over the top of my head. a green a blue thing and now the blue thing isn't there anymore after i died is that just minus one those guys didn't drop any Should have seen that coming. That was super obvious. <gasps> I'm level thirty. Let's go. defenseless people. I don't know how I if well, they're corrupted. It's fine. These people are just kind of like kneeling and being sad and I'm just killing them for levels. Yarn and silk. Thanks. This might be another boss. Oops. Uh, maybe not? Nope, it just means I made it. Let's go. Oh, oh let me... Oh, yes! A fragrant vine. Can I go over here? Nope. Okay. I... No! Son of a bitch! Hold on, let me get my incense thing. Wherever that is. Wait, I saw it leading, but I don't. <gasps> ah! He got me. <laughs> Awkward. Uh, oopsie. <laughs> oh man, I'm so mad that I died after I got that blue thing, because Mushroom is the number one killer. Yeah. Man, I'm mad I didn't get that blue thing, because now that's like minus one. Spirit, I don't think I'll ever get that back. Okay, where does it go? It goes here. Hey, you! Oh, rip. Oh. Give me that. That mushroom really came for me. I didn't even see him. He just... He, I ran away and I was like, where'd he go? And then he killed me. <laughs> Oops, here it is. We're getting close to their tornado. More shield guys. 
I'll just murder them to death, no problem. Uh, self-advance. Uh, yeah, reignite. What am I doing? Hmm. Oh, mana. Okay. Uh, let me rest before I forget. I mean, I guess I don't really need to, but I'll do it anyway, because I do keep forgetting that I need to do that before I perish. My horseman. Wow. Oh, it's so pretty. I love this game. It's beautiful. It's crazy how pretty it is. Okay. Wanted to lock onto you. this up. More will. Okay. Your nostrils are feeling the sandstorm. It's so real. Yeah. The sand, it gets everywhere. Oh, sand, it's so irritating. It just, it gets everywhere. It's like glitter. It's like natural, it's like the Earth's glitter. Oh, what's the quote from Star Wars? I don't like sand, it's coarse and it gets everywhere. Oh, this seems like a boss, if I've ever seen one. Whoa, bro! Just got here! Woo! Whoa! I didn't even stand a chance. He just three, like, three shot me. Well, I wasn't being very careful either, so... I deserve that. I deserve that! Um... I'm just gonna run. Oh, uh, I didn't open this. Let me open this. Literally ran past treasure. Thank you. It's probably yarn. Silk! Oh yeah, I meant silk. That's usually what it is. All right, bro. Ha. <laughs> Whoa. 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 This guy is crazy. I like him. I I fucked up. <laughs> ah, okay, everything has a follow-up. Everything has a follow-up. Woo!
everything has a follow up. This guy is feral. Holy shit, bro. still chapter two Aries, yeah uh chapter two the chapters kind of just like progressively get bigger and bigger and bigger over time like i can show you in the journal um we enter a new chapter it um like adds a bunch of bosses oh we missed something um yeah, this game is ginormous, and it'll show you, like, all the new ones you haven't come across. It's huge. This game is really big. Uh, it's awesome. Yeah, the game is massive, and all the bosses, what I like so far is every boss I fought has felt unique. Like, everyone is different. me awkward Yeah, that's right. Take that. That's your karma. Uh-huh. You failed. Rest in peace, bro. Give me that. Weirdest boss you fought so far. Hi, Great White Buffalo. Weirdest boss? Uh, a weirdest. I don't know what weirdest. Maybe the baby. <laughs> the baby is weird. The gold baby. Well, I mean, his name was Junchi, but. Where? Yeah, I guess. We've only barely scratched the surface, so I'm sure there will be more. <laughs> I like when boss fights reflect their lore and personalities. Me too. Yeah, I want to read about that guy. Who was he? Stop everything. This is important. Lesser Yalgwise. Oh, shit. Look at that. Oh, wow. Tiger's Acolyte. He is so great. Yeah, that's also what I like too, is the bosses all feel very, like, unique and different. And a big part of it is because they all have different personalities and like different stories and so like it just all feel really fun and unique it's beautiful i love it uh tiger's acolyte where has the swordsman gone with tears in his eyes the wild wind sweeps the northern sands lonely and desolate skies grass visits the empty village huts dust welcomes evil guise who knows the bitterness of the lotus heart or the sourness within the pear's guise that is a poem. That was a lot of words for that one. 
There was once a swordsman, wild and free, who roamed the lands far and wide. For the love of a woman, he forsook his wandering ways, married and had a child. Uh oh, this, sounds, this is going to be sad. But their happiness proved fleeting. From the mountains beyond the city walls, there arose a wind, fierce and full of malice. It whipped the yellow dust into a frenzy, and the city was choked with it day after day. Soon his wife succumbed to the wasting sickness, and their child too became ill. The man was devastated. He spent all his silver in vain in an attempt to heal his child. Then he heard of a bodhisattva, bodhisattva? I can't say that word, on New Mount Samiru, who could cure the wind sickness with haste. He gathered what he still had and set forth with his child. When he reached New Mount Samiru, the disciples told him that the bodhisattva had departed for Yellow Wind Ridge long ago and had not returned. The man had no choice but to take his child and set out once more. When they arrived at the ridge, they learned that this place was right next to the fierce wind. The child's fair condition worsened with each passing hour. They took shelter in the village of Windrest, where the child rested and the man went to find Bodhisattva. One day, while passing a dry well outside the village, the man heard a tiger's roar. He climbed down into the well and found a hidden cavern, where a ti great tiger lay, wounded and weak, deep in medita meditation. Oh, interesting. Sounds like Demon Slayer. <laughs> Hello, thanks for having me. Yeah, welcome in. Ick, 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 ick. Yeah, Demon Slayer. Dude, I love Demon Slayer. I haven't watched. There's a new season. I haven't watched it yet. And I and I need to. I love that show. I love it. It's so good. The tiger told the man he was a deity in the mountain, revered by the village priests. In the valley, they had even raised a temple in his honor. He said he had been ambushed by a Yao Guai that stirred up the fierce wind and took over his temple. That's why he was in this pitiful state. Oh, interesting. The man was doubtful, but as he asked around in the village, he found that the tale was true in every detail, from the reverence of the priests to the temple in the valley. He hastened back to the well, his ailing child in his arms, to beg the tiger for healing. The tiger brought out a strangely shaped gourd, filled it with water, and gave it to the child. Wonder of wonders, after drinking from the gourd, the child was able to run and play as he had before the wind sickness struck. The tiger told the man that the wind had harmed his essence. With the flesh of the living, he could regain his former might, and then he could tame the raging wind and heal the child completely. The man was reluctant, but as he watched his son grow stronger day by day, playing in the village with the other children, a terrible resolve hardened in his heart. He began to lead the unsuspecting villagers into the well hoping to restore the tiger to its former strength. Ooh. As time passed, most naturally the villagers found out what he had done. By the time the man returned to the village, they found his son slain by their angry hands. <gasps> no! The man was consumed by regret and drew the sword he had sealed away for years. He fell upon the villagers and one by one he cut them down until the streets ran red with blood. Then, alone, he set out into the shifting sandstorm, lost in the ever-howling Chat, that's so, that's sad. <laughs> that made me sad. No, why the child? I'll take it out on them. That's so awful. Oh great, more bat boys. I forgot about this. should be a movie yeah i know that it's based on journey to the west which is a book i don't know if they ever made a movie from it though or, or if they did it's an old one and i think that this game is a different character um but it is based on journey to the west Blaze Reliquary. Oh, pretty. Let me look. Uh, while perfect dodging, recover a small amount of stamina. Oh, I like that. I like that. I mean, this little piece of side story is worth the movie alone. Yeah, true. It is. It's really good. I I really like this. What 
the? What the? Cade, you can't be laying on my c mouse, buddy. <laughs> I couldn't move and it was because my cat was laying on my mouse. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> He's doing his best. What was that noise? Yeah. He's still cute, though. I love him, even when he does that to me, like, constantly. Oh, it does say I did miss, like, a boss back before, uh... Between these two. So we'll have to make sure... I am not leaving until I get them all! Uh-oh. It's another boss. Hold on. It's the classic sacrifice everything and abandon humanity for something and lost that thing after. Yeah. Classic. Okay. I will move forward. I'm trying to be very thorough. You know how it'd be. No matter how thorough. Stone Vanguard! No matter how thorough you are, something will always get in your way. Holy nut, bro! That was forever. Oh, okay. He does an AoE around him. Okay. Ow! Stone forms the mountain's bones. True. I gotta, I gotta go my far. Oh yeah, no, I... I know... Wait. Is there no... I guess not. Poor guy. Hmm. I'm looking. I'm trying to observe with my eyes. Did I miss? Hold on a second. I think I'm gonna switch this back. Excuse me. Pardon me. Oh, you know what? I like, you can do like a jump attack.
Hey now. <laughs> I like the the ragdoll effects in this game is so good. <laughs> Like, they turn into, like, dust, but, like, before they do, yes. Okay. And is there anything over here? Oh, nope. I thought maybe there was something back here. Maybe not. I like the ragdoll effects. They're just really good. They're funny. Hey, now. Watch yourself. All right. Oh, we just go again. Just a longer run than I was expecting, so I just wanted to double check that I didn't, like, miss something. Ah! I... I, yeah, yeah, okay. Bro doesn't care about my feelings. This is cool too. I like the design. He'll hit him in his little rock butt. Ow! Ow! <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Oopsie. My bad. Oopsie, my bad. Okay. Wait, can I level again? Excuse me, I might be able to. Got some will? Oh, let me look. No, I just wanted to make sure. Okay. Sweet. Go back. I think his weak spot is his booty, but maybe I was just being drama. Just sprint. Nice try, buddy. I can't wait till that guy sings again. I'm really excited. I love that song. Oh, you know what I wonder? Can I? Oh, I can't. Okay, I just wanted to see if I could go over there, but since we're in the fight now. Ah! Ah! <laughs> this guy is kicking my butt.
Get him! I'll try. I actually think I might be able to... Ow! I actually think I might be able to... Ow! I might be able to, like, go to that save point without, like, activating the fight. I'm dead. Ah. Hey! Good. All right. All right. Yeah, I think let, I'm going to try and see if I can do it without activating the fight. I like that those guys make a horse sound. It's funny. <sighs> okay. When I die and have to do the run back, I just keep looking at things again. I'm trying to bamp serpent. Back to through the cave. Or they're spinning at me. Ow! Hey now. Please don't touch me. Let's see if I can do this. Okay, yeah. No! No! You nut! Fine, I get it. I get it. him in the butt. Ow! Okay, I forgot.
<laughs> ah! No! Get him! Ah! Oh! I need to stop doing that. I keep doing this thing where I have no health and I do the baby head. And I can get hurt when I'm in that, but I'm being greedy. I get greedy. <laughs> no, yeah. <laughs> that was sad. That was the best try, though. He's not too bad. He's just chunky. Which, you know, checks out because he's a rock guy. <laughs> he's just very chunky. I love the music. I want more. And we can't sneak past him. We have to actually fight him. So. Mm, I can smell dinner. Penny is making full of pork. Sandwiches, and I'm really excited about them. We're putting them on like Hawaiian rolls. All right, Stone Vanguard, I get you now. Well, that reminds me, I have ice cream. Ice cream, I want some ice cream. I am throwing. Still the Kit Kat ice cream bars? Ow, bitch! I'm gonna try to save my magic. Or halfway. on me s'mores lasagna that sounds interesting ow I'm gonna die I'm dead. <laughs> s'mores lasagna? What is that? You are making s'mores for dessert? You need to have dinner before you have ice cream? Why? 
I already had ice cream today. Uh, well, I had, we had uh, an ice cream, like, S Snickers bars in the freezer, and there was one left, and I ate it after lunch. Trying to make some one day, but my graham cr crackers went stale because I kept forgetting to make it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Not the stale graham crackers. That's such a sad thing. Stale graham crackers are sad. So what? You just do, like, graham crackers... Marshmallows, chocolate, and then like put it in the oven or something. Is that like it? At first, I saw grandpa's went stale. <gasps> Not the grandpa's! Grandpa's going stale. Oof. I mean, that's kind of what being, you know, our grandpa is. You just. everything aches. And you are stale. Okay, I'm gonna beat him now. Well, they were dead, so I would imagine they're pretty stale. Oh! I forgot her! Solfin, how are you doing? <laughs> oh, Elden Ring, true. <laughs> I'm getting my butt kicked by. Ah! A rock. You were dead? Oh no. You tie you like work today or something? Whew. Ow! I'm dead. Oh, yikes. Damn it. <laughs> no, you had to get the card fixed. <gasps> oh, your car's falling apart. Oh my god, Sulfan, I am so sorry. Oh man, am I ready to eat? Let me do one more try and then, yeah, I will come eat. Let me do just one more. Let me do one more. I'm sorry, Sulfan, that sucks, man. I. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I feel that about car troubles. Like, it feels like with car stuff, it's like when it rains, it pours. So I feel you. I'm sorry. That is rough. They're running back to the boss again. Can't pull it together. He's got like four moves. You can do it. Okay, it's 16 years old and it's a dodge, so it's not like I expect to last forever, but damn, it's hurting right now. Yeah, I I mean I bet. 
sounds rough because you've had multiple issues with it. Also, thank you for the follow. Okay, last try before I go eat dinner. Ah! Ah! I, I was too slow. I yeah yeah. Okay, no, pull it together. This is the one. Yeah. This is the one. Kick his ass. Does he have an ass? Oh, he does. He has an ass. Look at those cheeks. He's got do rock shit. No. But he does have an ass. I mean, look at it. Ow! No, let me look at it. Ah! I am dodging that. What dead ass do? <laughs> Eat me up. That's what it does. He's being ass shy. <laughs> Be afraid. Look at you have great cheeks. Just because you're top heavy. It's okay. He gets a little shy. Ow! Top heavy is how I like them. Ow! Okay, here come the boys. I dodged. Okay. Hey, I dodged. What do you mean? Okay, whatever. I didn't. I. I'm alive. Ah! I'm dead. <laughs> well, it's fine. Imagine those cheeks if he did leg day. Oh, yeah, true. Those hashtag squad goals. <laughs> All right. I'm going to go grab my... I'm going to go eat my food. So I'll put you on the BRB screen. We'll be back in about five to ten minutes. Doesn't take long. I feel like Gamba coming on. Uh, listen, I'll go eat my food. I'll come back and I'll beat him first try. Sure, yeah. Do a gamba. <laughs> All right. BRB. Enjoy the clippies. Mwah. You can enjoy the clippies. Because it's broken. Why is it broken? Now what do I do? I'll just leave you here and turn on some music, okay? Your hair looks so cute today. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, my BRB screen is broken right now, so... I will just turn on some music and leave you guys with Mr. Monkey. Alright?
on one of your YouTube vids. I should have done that. I didn't see your comment before I was already gone. Well, I guess I could have done that, huh? Noted. I'll do that next time. Or, you know, I'll try to make sure I fix it before next time. I completely forgot about that. Hi, Gus. 73% feral. How are you doing? I just ate dinner. And now I'm back. How are you? So Kenny informed me that there's like a secret quest with this guy. And that I missed a direction. I let Kenny tell me secrets when we're eating dinner. So we're gonna backtrack a little bit. Um and uh Go explore some more. Coming out of Apex Legends ranked farming, I'm exhausted. Holy shit. Kenny backseating at the dinner table. He's getting around it. You're right. He, you're right. Nobody but me in it. Oh, you did a prediction. <laughs> no. It's fine. Yeah, Kenny backseat at the sack me at the dinner table. He'll be like, just so you know, Kenny, my favorite part about Kenny's sack feeding is he'll be like, did you get this item? And I'm like, what are you talking about? What item? And he's like, oh, you got to get that item. And I'm like, I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> Let me see if I have it. If I have one. You're talking about this? One of these gold pieces, Kenny? So he said there's another direction to go. That I didn't go. The eyes. The eyes! I don't have any eyes. Would it be a key item? I don't know what you're talking about. Keep going that way? Okay. I guess I'll just keep moving forward then. I guess I didn't come over here. No, I didn't, because there's a giant rock guy. Or guai, should I say. <laughs> yeah, let's do that. Can he help me? Because I want to fight every single boss, so I let him. Sack beat me a little bit. Excuse me, where are you? <laughs> Ow! Kutherton is now banned forever. Kenny has been banned. We should add a cow on that. Like every time. Oh yeah, also chat, celebrate. Did you guys notice? Kutherton got his name back. He's not Kuthi Poopy anymore. He's actually Cutherton again. Cutherton. On G, yeah. He he was so excited. He was like, "Cat, I got it back." Yeah, GGs. Now. Kutherton is banned forever. We should, you know, I should add to that. Every time someone gets banned, it says like, Kutherton is now banned forever. Kutherton has been banned this many times. <laughs> Fright Cliff. Okay, I, I definitely did not do this. He's always going to be Kuthi Poopy to me. <laughs> that's so funny because I'm pretty certain that's what Acton said when we told him. He told Acton and they were like, yeah, I'm pretty certain that Ares will always think you're Kuthi Poopy. We knew it. Oh, what is this music? <laughs> I'm okay with that, yeah. Oh yeah, I really want to read about these guys. Let's do it now.
with this creepy music. Hold on, because it's gonna bug me because I like them and I wanna know. Feathered corpse. Bay's bone. I wanna read this one. <laughs> Uh, this is the guys. These guys look so cool. So I want to know what their little story is. On the road, bare bones on display. Flesh rotted, decayed, faded away. Long gone, forgotten in name. His homeland lost in, de in death's claim. In the land of Yellow Wind Ridge, where relentless winds rage day and night, the tomb mounds were often ravaged by the mighty gusts, revealing the exposed bone, a sight all too familiar. Holy big paragraph. One day, a hurried merchant found himself passing through Yellow Wind Ridge on an urgent matter. However, the villagers warned him of the terrible danger and refused to be his guide. After walking alone for hours, the merchant rested by the roadside, eating his rations. It was then that he noticed a set of skeletal remains in the withered grass. The bones were incomplete due to greedy vultures and wolves. Were you slain by bandits lying here in this desolate place, or like me, did you find no joy in life and choose to end it yourself? Overwhelmed with sorrow, the merchant sighed as he looked upon the skull and wondered aloud. You now lie uncovered in the wilderness, and I can only imagine the sorrow your family must feel. Moved by compassion, he untied his bundle, weeping as he began to dig a grave to bury the remains. Suddenly, the skeleton sat up, startling the merchant, who fell to the ground and scrambled backward in fear. Using bony hands to support itself, the skeleton approached the merchant and pushed the bundle towards him. Astonished, the merchant cautiously accepted the bundle and resumed his journey. The skeleton followed him from a distance, and together they traveled peacefully for hours. Gradually, the merchant led, let his guard down and removed his inner shirt to drape it over the skeleton's frame. From that moment on, whenever a strange noise arose, the skeleton would guide the merchant to take cover behind rocks. With furtive glances, the merchant would then witness Gwise passing by the path. For several days, they continued on this way until the merchant finally reached the main road again. That was the moment of the, skele the skeleton ceased to move. Grateful for its companionship, the merchant offered to transport the skeleton's remains back to his homeland. However, after a moment's hesitation, the skeleton turned and walked back into the swirling sands of the ridge. Perhaps it had already forgotten where it came from. Oh, wait, that story is so cute. So basically, these guys are just like bones risen from the ground. I liked that story. Oh, the Buddha eyes. Me. Buddha's eyeball. Whoa, guys, I got an eyeball. Once again, carrying body parts in my bag. An eyeball extracted from the chanting Buddha heads of Fright Cliff. It may be inlaid elsewhere. Elsewhere? Offer the incense. Da da da. Oh, retrieve spirits. Oh. Oh, that's. Guys, remember earlier I lost one of the spirits and I was like, dang, minus one. If you miss it, or like you die before you pick it up, it'll be at the altar? That's actually so cool. What the hell? Wow, how generous. What a kind game. Do you think the bosses are easier or harder or similar to Elden Ring bosses? Um, I'm finding this game quite easy right now, honestly, in like comparison to like other games I've played. This game feels 
a lot more forgiving than like certain things. But then again, Elden Ring is a massive game with like a gazillion bosses. So like, I guess if you were to compare it to Elden Ring, I'd say this game is probably easier, but I am aware that the game gets very difficult at a certain point. Like the difficulty ramps up. Ow. Gotcha, yeah. This does this game does feel more like um out of worry to me. You son of a bitch. Dude, it has flowers, yeah. Sometimes those guys turn into enemies instead of just like materials. How are the bosses compared to a pre nerf consort? They're easier than anything I've ever done in my life. Pre nerfed consort. Holy. I will take my gold star for RL1. Before the nerf, thank you. My big fat golden star. I love that sound. Oh, give me that. That's a spirit. I want that. I want that. Yes, give me a rock. Oh, maybe this isn't the one. Yeah, yeah. What the? Hiya, hiya. Holy nut. These guys are scary. Ow! Listen to that music in the background, though. Oh, I guess he wasn't a spirit. He was just blue. Oh, pretty. Um. Got another eyeball. Always break the pots, chat. It rewards you. Oh, so pretty. The architecture. I'm not a fan of not being able to attack it.
I like the kicks. So, uh, what I'm getting out of the story in this area so far is that something happened that caused the winds to, like, go crazy. And it made the people sick and turned them into monsters and shit. Is, that's kind of what I'm getting right now. Kind of. Kind of. Mmm, delicious. Ow! <gasps> oh, it's a dragon! Well, this guy's probably gonna kick my ass. Oh, I was reading the dialogue as I was fighting this guy because I'm a Giga Chad. Intriguing. We found another dragon. What the? Oh! He has a grab attack! Aya! What the fuck? I'm dead. That's a brutal way to die. Yeah, well, he gra he like carries me. He car he grabs me with his shield and then throws me on the ground. <laughs> I curse. <laughs> oh, there was Buddha eyes over here. I got distracted by the dialogue. Um. They will sing to me. <gasps> Ow! Scary. Ow, I forgot. Ow! I love these guys. <laughs> I love them because they're like feral. Nice. Let's go back up and kill this other guy. So, this guy has a grab attack. Hurry up. Ah! Uh oh. <gasps> Ah! Ah! Oh, I forgot there was another one on the way to that guy. Well, anyway, yeah. It would be cool to take his mask, huh? I like the mask. Well, it might actually be their head. Maybe not a mask, because... It's like a horse skull, and they neigh like horses. Okay, there's another guy... Don't let him follow you. Here we go. Wow. 
Wouldn't be the first time we've taken someone's head to become our mask. True. True. Valid and true. This guy hits hard. I ran out of stamina. Give me your soul. Woohoo! Neat. This one's clearly a secret. Check this out. I, I don't know how this is gonna go. This guy might destroy me, so we might just try to fight him a little bit and then come back later. Because this is the secret, like a mega secret boss of chapter two. And these bosses can be rough. So, yeah. <laughs> yes. Ooh, oh, I'm excited. I just split my lip. I am monkey. It will destroy you. Whoa! Black Luong. Oh! Whoa! He's crazy! Alright, here we go. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Oh! He two shot me. shouldn't be here <laughs> um let me try one more time though I didn't even get to try anything holy nut soon they will no longer be with us <laughs> Can't see. Hi, yeah, yeah. Oh. Jump. Oh, I got to jump. Oh, it's a banger, huh? It is. Yeah. Well, maybe they will still be here with how little damage you're doing. Yeah, he is chunky. I think I don't think I should be here. I think we should turn back because <laughs> this is the mega secret boss of chapter two or yeah, this is like a super like a, su a super secret boss chapter two. The Luong brothers are like secret bosses, like secret dragon bosses. In each chapter, there's four of them at least, that I know of. 
Because there's four brothers in the story. And, um, yeah, that guy, he, I don't think we're supposed to be there. <sighs> uh oh, I'm about to have the whole valley chasing me. Is that it? That looks like an NPC. Hello? You are! Oh! You good, bro? Oh, hey! I have something for you! You're welcome. You're welcome. Look at those nails. Damn, look at those nails. Oh, I love them. Oh, he's gonna go to the temple. Okay. Interesting. I will have to make sure I go back there then. Son of a nut! Little gremlin. Oh, meditation. I love meditating. No, it just cut off the song at such a good part. We're so cool. I love being a monkey. It's so fun. Not climb. Let me in. Let me in. Yeah, let me in. I can't go inside. I can't climb. Did not see any Buddha eyes. I dodged. Just spam. I have a lot of stamina. <laughs> the death animation. That was so good. Oh, the golem. I see. Okay, I missed eye some eyeballs. Keep exploring. Oh, <laughs> 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 you scared.
scared me. Ah. I even remember that he would do that and I messed up the dodge. Beautiful, okay. So, hmm, intriguing. Haha. <laughs> Okay. Uh oh. Oh, I hear one. I hear a Buddha. The eyes are calling to me. They're neighing. What the fuck, bro? All right, well. Their aggro range is so far, dude. It's kind of crazy. I'm unsure what I'm getting inflicted with. Someone is calling to me. Oh, down here. What's up, bro? Ow! Ow! Okay. Ow! You want something from me. The rock fly. Okay, hold on. There's... Taking Pupper out, BRB. Sounds good. Have a good time taking the pupper out. Ow! Stop sh throwing shit at me! It's gonna kill me. Hold on. <gasps> There's Buddha eyes, too. I ran out of health. ran out of hell. That's on me. There. 
this place is scary. Dude, part of the reason why I feel like I have to kill everything is because, ah. Uh, they follow, they like literally follow me into like the ends of the earth. Wrong way. See, if they go too far, they just disappear. But their aggro range is forever. It just goes forever. Okay, where did I go? Into here. It's literally right behind me. LOL. Or no, it's not. Hey, where is it? Is it this way? It is. It's this way. And then up over this ridge. Okay. Wow. Okay. I want to get the eyeballs. Why did that sound like a cleric beast? I think I'm just, I've got a bloodborne brain rot. Ah! Ow! Okay. Just went around in a circle. Where? Ow. Your girl is lost. But what is new? There we go. Okay. I love how it sounds. It's so nice. <laughs> I'm gonna die. I uh, stop locking on. Yeah. 
know what? Screw this. Let me grab this first. I can't. Ah! There we go. Anyway, no panic. Ma. It says, duh, duh, nee, 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 nee. So there's six. I can tell because, not just because I got told, but also because it gives you a hint. This little nerd. That's great. That's great. Hiya! Dude, you like can't run away in this game. Like, you literally have to, like, fight everything. Ugh. Or else it's such a big pain in the ass. Because everything kind of chases you down to the ends of the earth. And this is the entrance. I have what, four of them? Let me take a look at how many I have right now. I have five. I'm missing one. Right. Listen for the music. The chanting. you oh, I have three sparks oh shit what a momento Cannot awaken? Oh. Mm, now I can awaken, but I need another spark. Okay. She's learning. Okay.
Hmm. I didn't hear any the Buddha eyes are not here. But that song is really nice. I like that song. That's the boss. They're really cramping your usual run through the area, aren't they? Yeah, they are. This game, it feels like I have to kill everything. Because if I don't, I will get... Like, I can't... Their aggro range is so far. Like, they just chase me to the ends of the earth. It's crazy. They're cramping my style. I just want to run. Well. Yeah, they were cramping my styles, Chef, it's true. This isn't normally how we do things around here. We've been over here? Yes, we have. Because there's the- Ah, uh, hey, you, bitch! Hey! Hey, bro, I'm getting stunlocked. Bro, I'm getting stunlocked by a fucking rock. Embarrassing. All I wanted to do was find eyes. Let me find eyes. Hey, I dodge. Just want to run. Where is other Buddha eyes? I'm missing a set, right? Da, 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 da. Yeah. Bro, uh, you guys are cramping my style so hard. Here, you know what? Let's go back to the temple. Um, and see that NPC and then come back because I'm apparently bald. He said he was coming to the temple, didn't he? Or... What? Huh? He's not here, though. He said, oh, yeah, I'm going to go to the temple, so I'm starving. He is not here. Hmm. Huh. Oh, well. Oh, 
What's this? Oh, after using the gourd, the next rock solid costs no mana. Oh, using the gourd moderator increases damage reduction. Using the gourd moderator increases poison resistance. Oh, shit. Okay. I mean, to tell you... the la Where the last one is? Is it different than the other ones? You're back with your s'mores for both parts. Both parts. Like, what do you mean both parts? You are saying it like I know. I don't. The boar and the eyes. Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, sure. But no, don't say it in a spoilery way, though. I know how you are. <laughs> you will be like, the boar is here and he's dead. <laughs> it's crazy. The item for the boar you buy from an NPC you haven't found yet. Oh, okay. Sounds good. So noted. We'll be on the lookout for another NPC I can't have, I haven't found yet. The eyes are in a cave you haven't found yet. Okay. Um. In Fright Cliff, though. They're in Fright Cliff. Because I'm pretty certain the cave is um for an NPC quest I just picked up for the rock guy. Yeah, in Fright Cliff. All right. Okay. Yeah, because I did find, like, the rock guy. Explore the area where you found the first eye more. Okay. Oh, I think I went too far. Because I found, um, the NPC rock guy. Hey, bitch, what in the fuck? Are you serious? <laughs> Mofo. That's rude. All right, I will look around by the first eye. Oh, you got the rock vendor? No, I didn't get him. I met him and he said, go... Go take care of this for me. So, the first eyes. I overthought. 13% calm. Elected. What the fuck? Dude. Gotcha. What you need is in the cave. Yeah, that's what I assumed. I'm missing, like, one thing. One cave? Chef is 70% feral. Did I never go in here? I went in here. Okay, I did. You did not. Oh. <laughs> Dude, freeze them. That's it. Uh, because I went up there and there's like a cave there. poked your head in the entrance and then you ran away 
And that little guy? I picked up a big chunk of will from there, like, a while ago. Um... Bro! You fucker. I hate these guys! I don't like them. throwing your shit at me oh <laughs> how dare you do things while I'm not paying attention <laughs> I'm sorry, you have to let me know that you're not paying attention. Oh, I missed this. The areas are so densely packed with stuff. A mind core. It's like hard to know what I have and haven't done. Wow. You can't go down. I want to go down. I'm looking for a cave. I'm looking for a cave, sir. Have you seen a cave? No? Okay. Bye-bye. No. Uh. To the shrine by the waterfall? What? I was over there, and you said go to where you found the first eyes. The first eyes are found right there. <sighs> Those freaking eyes, bro. The eyes. Staring at us with murderous intent. Yeah, murderous intent. I will murderously intent the shit out of them. Hiya! When I get multiple crits in a row, it sounds like a wallet. Because it sounds like clink clinking coins. Hold up. I was waiting for that so I could do this. You can get there from the other shrine too, but this way is easier. Uh, okay. Well, then I will keep looking for... I'll keep farming levels. 
No! Bitch. Dude, those guys sound like cleric beasts. Am I tripping? Fuck! <laughs> I hate them. No! That new dodge move is so is awesome. So do I have to like backtrack or Is that poison? It's poison. Because I came over there. What the fuck? I'm so dead. Dude, they sound like cleric beasts. I don't like it. Is it up this way? Aha, I'm blind. I didn't see this path. Oh. I'm gonna die. I didn't know that guy. He didn't move when I walked up to him. Okay, now I know. Now I know where. There was like a path that... So I came up the path and there was a path right next to it. Got it. This place has got a lot of paths in it. It's hard to know which ones I did. <laughs> That ass, holy shit. <laughs> I'm getting 
my ass kicked. Dying. <laughs> I'm gonna die! <laughs> my nose started itching. <laughs> This is no time to be staring at asses. Well, it's too late. <laughs> it's too late now. Dude, my nose started itching as I was fighting them too. That was horrible. I had to itch it. Dude, and uh, man, their aggro ranges are ridiculous in this game. This is crazy. This mofo will literally... Shit, I fucked up. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> no. Why? Dude, these things are so chunky. so many of you get this mom get her up I'm beating up a defenseless woman that's a boss you know why it's a boss? It's a boss because of the ads. Fine. I will kill all the ads. Die. 
Holy shit, dude. <laughs> Poystone. I would like to be that. Okay. Okay. Just like to be beating up this defenseless mother of stones. Well, shit. There's one more. I think I did it. Kill her! Murder her to death! Do it! Yeah, farewell, lady. I almost feel a little bad for that one, I'm not gonna lie. Thanks. <laughs> there we go. Yay! Thanks, Aries. Ooh. Beautiful. That was great. Thank you. Okay, sick. So. Let's read. I need to understand. I think if I remember correctly, this story is actually kind of sad. Mother of Stones. 
A fate al as fate aligns, chance plays its part. And misfortune leaves an empty heart. Judge not a hero by skill alone, by the fortune that they have shown. Uh oh. Long ago in the yellow wind ridge, there lived two mountain deities. By the grace of a wise one, they came into possession of a great Yawai's inner pill. They split and consumed it, gaining great powers from within. Thenceforth, they bore the shape and heart of humans. In gratitude, they bent their newfound strength to make the mountain's wilds thrive for the wise ones. The keeper of the mountain, however, received no share of this boon. Envy wormed its way into his heart upon learning that the deities could conjure rockwise at will. He schemed to wrest this power for himself. Uh oh. Little did he know their conjurations drained deeply from their own will. The mountain deities poured out their own power to birth rockwise, who shaped crag and stone and nurtured green and bloom. Day by day, the keeper of the mountain sought to pill for their practice and cultivate through low deceits. Then came a day when a ro great rock Y emerged and the lesser wise bowed to them as their vanguard. Still, the keeper, heedless of the, his peril, provoked strife as he had done before. Blow after blow, the stone vanguard rained upon him until he lay pummeled in the dirt. Even then, he did not cease hurling curses. Alas, those who are bent on wickedness find new obstacles in their path, while those who pursue virtue encounter many hardships, often set by those with ill intentions. I'm pretty certain the keeper of the mountain is the guy who told us to go kill her, this, this chief. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that it's him. He was jealous. Let's go back to him. So I'm pretty certain it's here. Oh, it's here. Somewhere. Bro, this area makes no sense. No, it's... Hold on. You know what? Let me let me rest. <laughs> let me let me do it. <laughs> Cuz oh shit. I don't remember. Oh. Where is this mofo? He's not over here. He's not over here. Excuse me, I gotta backtrack. He's in the place where they were shitting at me. Which I think is over here. Yeah, he's down here. I gotta kill these... Little spitters. I made it. Yeah, I do. Thank <laughs> you. 
Cease! Your ass kicked by a monkey. Now he beg for mercy. Give me that. Oh, I thought we would talk. Oh, we can talk now. Ha! Give me that. He called me a twerp. Okay. Oh, you need to restock. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, sorry. So now I can make it so that I become immune to everything for a moment. Or two. Okay, let me go back. Why is he in a ho such a horrible spot for trading? Like he's in the middle of this freaking ravine where they're spitting shit at me. Why don't you lay in the air? What? Legal? What? Huh? Is that a song I'm supposed to know? Welcome in. <laughs> We're defeating enemies. Sobering stone. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is, um... Hmm. It's just some nonsense. Oh. I like seeing how people react to stupid shit. That's cool. How's, do you like it so far? It's great. I love this game. It's really fun. It's really, really fun. The uh, gold or something, maybe it can be exchanged for something valuable. Uh, epic. Kenny, do I need to buy anything from this guy? I could get this. This is kind of cute. You do. Which thing? Is it this one? Or this? Or this? I think it's this. It can be used to exchange for something valuable. Because I bought this. So unless I need to buy another one, what what should I buy from him? I mean, I could probably buy everything. No, maybe not. Oh, you already got that? Yeah, I found one laying around. And I talked to the guy and he said, oh, I'm hungry. I'm going to go to the temple. And I said, okay, cool. And I went to the temple and now he, I don't know where he is. <laughs> he moved forward, I think. And I gave it to him. Did you miss that? Maybe you you were making dinner. You missed that. Okay. Do I need this? Maybe it can be exchanged for something valuable. Yeah, I talked to him. He was like, oh, I'm drunk. He should be at the temple. Uh, he should be? No. 
Ow! Ow! Um, so I went to the temple. He's on the right side of Tony Temple. He's on the right side? Okay, I guess I didn't really, like, search very hard. But I went there expecting him to kind of just be, like, in plain sight and he wasn't. <laughs> so I was like, uh. Here, let me go back. Uh, there we go. Country road. Oh, there he is. I, dude, I, I literally, I'm not kidding you. I came down here and I was like, hmm, I don't see him. Bro was literally right there. I'm just blind. Hey, dude. Jade <laughs> Lotus. I actually think I did find some. Yeah. Yeah, I thought there you couldn't take the dumbed version. You didn't like it? I mean, to each their own. A rat tastes like men flesh? Oh, what of it dumped? Yeah, the, I mean, I think both. Oh, sorry, I'm. I read your thing wrong. I think it's subbed and dubbed. I think they're both good. I just wanted to really hear it in like, you know, the mother language in which it was made. All right. Sick. So he. Gave me a hint for something. Okay, now we'll go back to... Uh, I'm not ready to fight this guy. I'm scared. It was this one? <laughs> Trying to figure out which, which run is easier. Because I've done it, like, a bunch of times. Which run is easier? Excuse me. If I can remember. I actually don't think this is it. Maybe it is. Ah, I just took the long way. Okay. Sometimes I just don't know which way is best. Here we go. What the? Deliver. That looks so sus. Is this where I needed my eyeballs? Oh! Oh, sumo wrestling match! Ooh, yeah, get him! Oh, shit! Earth 
golems. It's so over. That guy's on my side. Ow! You know what? You know what? I'm just gonna let them hash it out. Shigan Dung is my boy. This is so cool. Oh, this is so worth it. Cla ah! Ah! He hurt me! By smarter, not harder. Yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, beat his ass! <gasps> sumo! Oh! Sumo slam! Holy shit! <laughs> ah! I didn't know. Ah! <laughs> he won't see me. I gave you eyes. Ah! <laughs> Look at him. He's got a. He's got a rock ass too. Holy shit. Look at that booty. This guy is way slower. Okay, I'm out of stamina. I need to... <laughs> there was only one way this was going down. <laughs> True. Look at his face! Is like way easier. Uh oh. Whoa. Whoa. Kick his ass. <laughs> oh! Die, please. I don't, I'm not fucking around anymore. <laughs> yeah! I did it. The glutes. We had to kick his butt. Bro, oh, that was rude. I gave you life. He was, like, easier than the other guy. <laughs> Your boy got hit with a pile driver because you weren't assisting him? Pile driver? <laughs> well, I wanted them both dead, so now it's over. Hit him in the glutes. Rock guys have nice booty cheeks. It's crazy. Um, self advance. And also, I got a spell at one point. Yeah, what is this? Rockwai Sand Robust. Transform into a Rockwai. This is important. <gasps> Host! Host. Hello. Hello, Raiders. How's it going? Welcome in, everybody. What were you playing? Assassin's Creed 2? Ooh, fun. Is that like your first playthrough? I've never played any Assassin's Creed games. Welcome in. I hope you're doing so well. It is so good to see you. Snorts at Rock Eye comment. Oh, 
into another character. I have no idea what you're talking about. How are you doing? I'm fabulous, friend. Assassin's Creed is boring. All right, buddy. <laughs> I have never played them, so I have no opinion. I hope you're enjoying the games, Host. That's what's important, that you are enjoying it. You just are perfect to... First time playing it, anything like it, so you're learning a lot? Hell yeah, House, I love that for you, because... Yeah. I used to watch my dad and my brother play them a long time ago. I know some of them are really good, and some of them are not so great, but there's a lot of them, so... <laughs> Yeah, and Haas, that's fabulous. I love that for you. If you um need to rate and run, I totally understand. Don't know how long you've been streaming for, but I know it can be exhausting. So make sure you take care of yourself. Most of them. Everything uh everything before Black Flag. Yeah. Hi Fearsome! How's it going? As such being such a new gamer is something you have to try. Yeah. You gotta try it all. You, you might, you gotta give yourself the chance to try it, you know? I'm glad that you're trying it. Let's see. Fair, yeah, I see fair. I have, there's like, on my chat, there's so many like, yellow purple names. I'm afraid I'm gonna lose you guys. Cade <laughs> came to say hello too. But also you did like the Greek one. I was actually talking about um, Assassin's Creed with my brother a couple weeks ago. Each talent level in modern injuries focus on the perfect dodges. You have the catch treats right now. <gasps> oh my God, are you about to be blessed? Ugh. Okay, hold up. Well, ads just started, too, so let's do this right now. Whoops. Let's not pop the whole lid off. We need that. <laughs> Loki just woke up. Oh, yeah, you guys can see him now. Um, He looks so tired. Sorry, I'm trying to pour out a little couple more. There we go. Ugh. Okay, there you go. Here, up, up, look. Yep, there you go. <laughs> Let's see if Loki will eat. Here, come here. Oh my god, I'm so. Oh no, ads. Yeah, ads just started. Ah. Ads just started in the middle of this. Do you eat this? Ah! <laughs> this! Oh. There you go. Oh, they're so happy! Happy boys. Look, you guys can see Loki. Now he's not so rare anymore. That's crazy. <laughs> Loki is not rare anymore because field of view is large, huh? Boop. Say thank you, Aries. Cute babies. They're the cutest. You see the kitties. Yes. They are so cute. Come here. Oh, I tried to hold him and he rejected me. That was rude. Yeah, my cute babies. They're huge babies. How's Wukong going? It's amazing. Wukong is going positively fabulous. I love it. I love Wukong. I have been thinking about this game since I stopped playing on Wednesday.
Looking at a drop from rare to common rarity, this patch is crazy. Yeah, this patch is wild. It's crazy. My good friend just got a Sphinx kitten. Oh. I love Sphinx. They're so cute. I can't wait until it goes on sale eventually. Oh yeah, I definitely think that you should play this game. I love this game. This game is awesome. Her full name is Tessie. Her name is Tessie, full name Tess Tickle. <laughs> Wait, that's so great. I love that. <laughs> that's so funny. He initiate heavy attack during mobile spin to engage and stagger the enemy. That's so cute. I love Sphinx cats. They're just the cutest. Hmm. A single instance of damage. Oh, moderately increased crit damage. I like the baby one, though. It's funny. Critical hit chance. I want to try this one. Oh gonna grab a snack okay sounds good we will be here i want to try that one uh yeah let's i want to try this one because it does so when you equip one of these spirits it gives you like a passive effect and i want to see how this one does if not the tiger's acolyte could be fun Hmm. Well, I did it. That was fun. Wait, we have to read the lore. This is important. Stone Vanguard and Shigandang. We have two. All right, chat. Buckle up. Stone forms the mountain firm and true. Earth's essence prize for all it can imbue. It's back bears towering rock reaching the sky lofty in stature and majestic in height the lore whore yes the lore whore she's back she's got to read it all or else it doesn't count if you don't read the lore it doesn't count no i'm just kidding i love reading it because it makes me appreciate it even more because look at how much work goes into it like it hurts there's so much to read every single enemy in the game has a story attached to them it's wild how much work they did like what the hell <laughs> ever since the yellow wind sage bestowed the buddha headed stone guise essence upon the two mountain deities they consumed it and gained human hearts and forms the union of the two resulted in the birth of a stone child thus the yao guise referred to them as father of stones mother of stones and son of stones later the father of stones left the mountain for some reason and the son of stones went in search of him leaving the mother alone oh I see. The Mother of Stones was never fond of violence. Rest in peace. Uh, <laughs> Cat is literally a precious angel? No, you. Thank you. <laughs> Who are you calling that? Me. I'm a lore whore. I love lore. I'm a whore for it. I love it. <laughs> I keep thinking about how taxing the translation work was. Yeah, like that's a lot of work. For to translate it and everything. Chinese is a very difficult language. I have three family members who know how to speak it. And like... Holy shit. <laughs> it's crazy. I don't know how they even learned anything. Are you jealous? Okay, you a hoe too. <laughs> Dang, thanks. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah. The Mother of Snow was never fond of violence. When the Yellow Wind Sage gave her the essence, he entrusted her with the task of diligently taking care of the mountain's inhabitants. She took this responsibility seriously and worked hard. When the journeyers passed through Yellow Wind Ridge, the Yellow Wind King captured Tong Monk, forcing Sun Wukong to seek Bodhisatt Bodhisattva's Lingji's help to capture him. Okay, hold up. When the journeyers passed through Yellow Wind Ridge, the Yellow Wind King captured Tong Monk, forcing Wukong to seek Bodhisattva's Lingji's help to capture him and take him back to Mount Lingshan. Oh, okay, so there was some turmoil here. Years passed, and upon the return of the sage, the ridge was populated with many stone guys. Among them was a particularly strong and robust stone guy, which he learned was created by the Mother of Stone with all her might to guard the cave. One day, the Yellow Wind Sage personally came to visit Mother of Stone, only to be blocked by the stone guy. Alarmed by their disobedience, he feared it might become a threat. Hence, he summoned the newly appointed Tiger Vanguard to eliminate the strong stone guai. Uh-oh. Tiger Vanguard agreed, but was reluctant to fight them. They had one, once worked together to rebuild the mountain, and he knew the strong stone guai was highly respected by the other stone guais, who saw him as an elder brother. He advised the stone guai, Brother, we've endured much to reach this point. If, you can, if I can help, I will. I've arranged everything. You just need to treat... In Retreat into the valley and keep a guard on Xing Dan Dong. No need for anything vicious. Today, I come with kind words, but tomorrow it might be a battle. Though we have some skills, we are no match for the yellow furred rat. Why not join me as a vanguard and keep things as they are? Ah, I see. The next day, the yellow wind sage appointed the strong stone guai as stone vanguard, ordering him to leave, lead the stone guais to retreat and guard the valley. From then on, the stone guys dutifully guarded the sealed evil being and no longer meddled in the mountain's affairs. Oh, intriguing. Half the game's text and dialogue is in archaic language, so almost untranslatable. Oh, really? That's wild. That's crazy. I didn't know that. Damn, they really went hard on this game, didn't they? <laughs> they went for it. That's so great. I'm proud of them. In the Sea of Bitterness... Oh, this is uh, Shigan Dong. You can't see the name, but you can see. I fought this guy. The baby rock man. What is happening? Okay, my headphones got stuck. Um, in the Sea of Bitterness, harsh winds bring the tide. Only those favored can reach the other side. The fragrance of rain soiled spreads far and wide, yet dustless in the realm where the Buddhas reside. Years ago, upon Yellow Wind Ridge, several cliff stones drank deeply of the essence of sky and earth, basking in the energy of sun and moon. In time, they awakened, transforming into sentient stone guais. Among them, two through advanced cultivation were bestowed with the title of mountain deities. Oh... One day, for reasons unknown, several Buddha heads emerged from the ground on the ridge. These heads, complete with eyes, ears, mouth, nose, and even flexible muscles, were profoundly bizarre. Upon seeing any living creature, they would scream loudly, and if approached, they would swallow the creature whole. Oh, wow. Okay. It's like they speak in Shakespeare prose. Yeah. <laughs> One stone guai, finding these Buddha heads strange and dangerous, decided to eliminate them protect the mountain's inhabitants it rammed into one of the buddha heads crushing it to a pulp however the flesh adhered to the stone guy's body and soon grew into a new stone buddha head uh-oh from that moment on the stone guy's temperament completely changed it began to roam the mountain searching for other buddha heads crushing them and allowing them to grow on its back as the number of buddha heads on its body increased so did its size it no longer took nourishment from the universe but instead fed on the mountain's living creatures to cultivate the other stone guys could not defeat it. A single punch from it would shatter them into pieces, destroying their souls. Destroying their souls? Damn. When the yellow-furred rat and his followers left the kingdom of flowing sands and passed through the yellow wind ridge, encountered the mountain deities leading several stone guys to drive the infested stone guy away, the yellow-furred rat seemed to understand the nature of those Buddha heads well. A strong sense of righteousness led him and his followers into battle. In a great victory, the yellow-furred rat not only destroyed the infested stone guai, but also eradicated all the flesh Buddha heads in the mountain. He extracted the essence from the guai and divided it between the two brave mountain deities. 
He also gouged out the eyeballs from the Buddha heads and placed them in the valley as a seal. Oops. The mountain's inhabitants greatly admired the yellow wind why. Seeing that he could summon the wind, they named him the Yellow Wind Sage and revered him as their king, settling with him in Yellow Wind Ridge. Ooh. Yep, here, here is Keeper of Black Wind Mountain, Man in Stone. I am apparently missing a lot of characters, but it's fine. Cool. That was cool. I love the stories! I cannot get over it. Nice try. I've played too much Souls games to get tricked by that one. I already got tricked. Son of a bitch! I knew it. Hey. Wait, that's all that was in here? Okay. Hello. Okay. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, instant death. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I was ill prepared. <laughs> it's true, I did. I died. is crazy he must die now he has to go I don't make the rules I I dodged the heck? <laughs> I don't like this guy. so greedy i was being greedy did we have wolf mage in last chapter rat kingdom seems to have more classes um did we have a wolf mage we had archers and then like shield guys sorry i threw because i decided to be greedy um i don't think we did i don't think there were any mages be silent nerd Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> die, 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 die. Hey. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. I can double check, but I don't think there were any wolf by mages. Rat governor. I got a governor? Damn, I got a governor in my pocket. Yeah, lessers. Uh, let's see. Scout. Sw sworn sword. Soldier. Stalwart. Archer. Sentinel. And assassin. There were no wolf mages. They're all just little warrior guys. That's cool. Yeah, the world expands. It's very nice. Whoa! Pretty. I like that. Okay. Opa! Maximum mana. Yay! Give me more mana. We're going down. I wasn't ready. I didn't realize I was going down a slide. That was fun. Hi, Janannan. How are you doing? I always try to climb everything. Fragrant jade flower. This guy's trying to blow me up. How? Hey! Hey now. Let me open it. Blood of Iron Bowl. Nice. Okay. Why does that seem like I should be able to climb up? Much better than yesterday? Well, that's good. I'm happy to hear that. I think I got the secret on that. Hopefully. Oh, I'm not moving. <gasps> Hello. What? He's very headless. <laughs> <laughs> oh, has he got a piece of hair? He gave me a piece of hair. Was ahead of the tune, yeah. Blowing strands into the air creates duplicates to assist in combat. Yeah, I got it. 
the best spell. Uh, fight with my homies. Thank you. Yeah! Okay, I'm excited. I'm excited. Pluck a strand, chew it, and spit it out to create multiple duplicates. Nice. Okay, that makes me really excited. Definitely gonna be using this. I'm kind of just like, I know I can just like respec at any time, so I'm kind of just throwing in skills where I wish. Pretty certain there's a boss right but over there, so I'm gonna wait though. I wanna go look over here. Oh boy, I'm so excited to make little duplicates. Are you nice? Gore I Dowis. What the fuck? You look crazy. I love you. He's making blood. It's poisoning me. It's poisoning me. He's creepy. happened what there's a random monkey or or a rat what are you hi I beat him that was wild Cool. Hello. Gore I Taoists. Gather. That would gel fragrant vine. Oh, we got more lore chat. This is important. Gore I Taoists. A strange man with a lump on his back and a staff of blood red hue. He leaps and bounds with eerie might, a hundred eyes glowing in the night. Ah. A strange visitor once came to the Temple of Yellow Flowers. Where is your specs? For my computer? Well, I did just get an upgrade last night. But if you're talking about my and my my character specs 
Your glasses? Oh. Oh, man, specs mean so many different things. What the hell? Well, they're um in the bathroom because I'm wearing contacts. <laughs> That's where they are. <laughs> you said specs. <laughs> it's called, yeah, I'm not blind, I promise. I heard PC upgrade. Yes, overthought. Kenny gave me his hand-me-downs. He just upgraded his PC. So he gave me his 4070 and a new PC power thing and new RAM. Like he he gave me all his shit. He was very kind. Didn't need to do that, but he did. So now my computer is is ready. New challenge run. Play blind. Yeah. Um well I'm um near sight. Well, I can see things close up. So I probably could play without any glasses or anything. But I probably wouldn't be able to read you guys very well. New GPU probably helps a lot. It does. Yeah. I, I, he upgraded from a 4070. Dang. He got a different brand. Um, I can't remember. We have the graphic settings now? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I could maybe, but I'm just going to leave it at low for now just to not risk it for the biscuit. <laughs> Cause yeah, yeah, you got a seventy nine XTX from AMD. Yeah, we're all upgraded and fancy now in this house. Yeah, I went from like a twenty something to a forty seventy. That's huge. It was a hand me down. Yeah, that's what I said. It is this. You handed it down to me willingly. We stayed up very late into the night. Putting it together. <laughs> it's great. It's great. And it runs really nice right now. Like, I'm... I'm very happy about it. So, but Yeah, I'm gonna read this now. Um, yeah. A 4080, so yeah, an upgrade. Oh, shit. The couple that nerds together stays together. True. I know, like, zero about, um... Computer stuff, so I just let him do it. It sounds like I give you old clothes. Well, you, I wear your sweater, so, so we'll stop nerding out. Oh, well, I mean, I don't know how it converts. You would know better than I, than probably most of us. Sounds like you give me old clothes. I mean, I do take, I do wear some of the clothes you don't, so. But you didn't really give those to me. I just wear them sometimes. <laughs> He'll be like, why are you wearing my sweater? And I say, your sweater? Don't you mean our sweater? <laughs> or my hoodie? No, our hoodie. <laughs> 4070 is one business better encoding than the 2000 series you were on. Yeah, definitely, for sure. And I can tell it's making a difference because my computer is, is, is running super well, even better than before, so... It's really happy with me. And that makes me happy. So, yeah. Anyway, a strange visitor once came to the Temple of Yellow Flowers. He proclaimed himself in the mystic arts upon the Mount Lin Lingtai. Submit now and yield to me the thing, he told the master of the temple, and you will be spared. The beetle commander was sent to subdue him, and the man was sealed in a cocoon sack in the cave. Beetle commander? Hmm. Yet days later, a lesser guai brought word to the master that the sack lay sundered and the captive had escaped. At this, the master gave nothing but a smile. Since his escape from the cocoon sack, from a sack, a fleshy mist studded with many eyes had sprouted from the man's back. He paid no mind to this horrific sight and continued his wandering practice. He passed through a desolate mountain where bandits ran rampant and the nearby villagers lived in squalor. Here he chose to settle and summon rain, summoned rainfall. By his arts... The blasted peaks grew green with elms and willows, and the slopes cloaked themselves in pines and firs. Uh, oh, nice. That's cute. Um, after his effort, the once barren mountain saw years of clement wa weather, and the people of the lowlands flourished in number. Yet the bandits cared nothing for an honest life. They saw the greenwood only as fresh plunder and the growing number as ripe for the hunt. 
The man then took on the guise of an enlightened monk and went among the bandits' hideout to spread the wisdom of the Buddha. In the end, even the bandits forsook evil and came down the mountain to live in peace. Oh shit. Years passed. Then came a day when the man entered the village and raised a ritual staff at the entrance. From its crown poured a blood red light. Every person it touched fell into a frenzy, tearing at each other as if under the thrall of some evil force. In mere moments, the lowlands became a pit of slaughter and the ground overflowed with blood of the slain. On the man's back, the hump gaped wide with countless eyes unveiled. Slowly, they supped the spilled blood and sundered spirits. In no time, the lump had swollen even larger until it could absorb no more. Only then did the eyes slowly close. The man came back to himself and removed the staff. He then set out for the next place to settle. Oh, yikes. Yikers. That's not good. All right. That guy's dead now. You can continue on this way. Take this. Hee <laughs> hee. I like how I just kind of like uh, beat that guy after I gathered some roots. I was like, hmm, I need these flowers. What the fuck? I hear you. Mm. Yeah, the you son of a bitch. The well was where the tiger vanguard was staying. And that's where the acolyte sent ch the children or the people of the village, right? I'm gonna assume. Interesting. This must be like the spirit of the dad's child. I don't see a well though. Okay. Yeah, the story is kind of sad. Um, I mean, the stories are all pretty sad. Like, they're so d depressing. They're really good. That seems like another boss. I can tell you where to go next if you want. Oh shit. For that quest? Oh. Is it not around here? Let's see. Have I seen a well? Here, let me go back. Um. 
for now, I think I'm okay. Just kind of keep going. Uh, can I use tally? What? <gasps> what? How come I didn't work on the other one? Oh, so I picked up a piece, but it led me to this one. <gasps> oh, because I tried on a couple others. Yellow wind formation. I tried on a couple others and like couldn't get in. Or they didn't work. Oh shit. Oh, I'm excited. Oh, I'm stoked. Because I know that the other ones are like hiding behind bosses or something, I think. Well, actually, let me look. Because he said that the other talismans are with two of the yellow wind sages, like, companions. Weapons. What is this? Moderately increases the damage executed by smash heavy attacks. Oh. Now, what about armor? <gasps> oh, upon perfect dodges, grant considerable focus. Slightly reduces cooldowns for all spells. Put it on. Whoa! Oh, it's pretty. I want it. Yeah, I'll wear a couple of these. Hello? Oh, I say I helped that guy before. Make medicines. Oh, celestial medicines. Whoa. Oh, a lesser celestial medicine that can moderately increase max health. So this is where I can like permanently max out some of my stuff. Oh, perma buffs, yeah. Oh, I kind of want to do. Oh, wow. Wow, how cool. Max stamina. Oh yeah, give me more stamina. And then I wanted Max Mana. This is cool. Wow. We. Okay.
recovery rate. Chill resistance, burn resistance, shock resistance. Let's do a health one. This game is really pushing alcohol and pills. <laughs> yeah, it is, huh? <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> cool. Wow, okay. Immortal. So just like the normal ones. Okay. Remake. Oh, so I can also have it remade. Okay, an ancient tattered page records the formula of longevity decoction. Well, upon use... Pieces help. Oh, yeah, I'll get it. Why not? Oh. Oh, thank you. Okay, noted. Ah, oh, I can't climb. <laughs> that is so cool. I like that. Imagine Kukri can spec anything in the game. Wow, unheard of. Yeah, they really... They, and it's so easy, too. You can kind of just respec whenever you want. Oh. Yellow Wind Sage? Wait, no, I don't want to fight you. You're the final boss of the chapter. Uh oh. Wait, I don't want to fight you. Because I know, I know you're the chapter boss. No! Just, just... It's fine, you'll die soon, surely. Ah! Oh. Here, I'll give it a chance. Ow. Holy crap, he's got a lot of health. I'm dead. I'm not gonna heal. <laughs> Hi, Haas, welcome back. Twitch froze, Twitch mobile's awful. Oh my god, yeah. Twitch mobile's pretty bad. I have installed it, and then I usually just end up uninstalling it because it's just not great. I don't really care for it very much. Okay, sick. Well,. Cool. I am not ready to fight him yet. I am not ready. No way. I know who he is. You believe in me? Thank you, Jananan. I'm sure I could if I wanted to, but <gasps> it's the guy. Oh, we meet again. You beautiful bean. Hello, King. It'll be a bit lurky, but here, well, I appreciate your lurk. Any lurks are appreciated. Long King. Long King. Thank you for the follow. Interesting. Thanks, bro. 
I'm gonna meditate now. <laughs> Hi, Groovy! How are you doing? It's good to see you. I like that emote. That's cute. Gave me some... Bro gave me some lore. Meditation made me yawn. Yay! Fix her from laughing. Saw you were on the vibe? Hell yeah. Welcome to the vibe. Yeah, we're just like chilling and killing. Bosses. <laughs> we have like a secret boss that we gotta fight. And. I haven't unlocked it yet, so how goes the monkeying around? It's great! Ruby, it's wonderful. It's super fun. We have more we gotta do in this chapter. I just saw the final boss of the chapter, but I know we're not done. There's a big secret here. Hey now. These statues are so cool. Ugh, so bright. I'm having a lot of fun. Pitchfork. Ow! Ah! Hold on, let me heal. This little guy. I've seen some Wukong streams. Seems fun. Unsure if PC would like it though. I don't have a PS5. Uh, it's on PC. This is. I'm playing it on PC. It is a bit intense, but like it. It. It can. It, I just got a computer upgrade, but when I was on my pre-upgraded PC, it worked pretty well. The graphics have are on low, but like, you know, as it do be. What? Can't get through that. Have a gaming laptop? Oh yeah, that I'm not sure. More CPU to go with GPU, yeah, always more. Oh. Oh, we went around in a circle. Okay. Let's see here. Oops. Okay, I think I actually have all of them. Hey! Hey! Screw you. Plugging laptop directly into NASA server. <laughs> I want more, but I'm not getting any time soon. Yeah, they cost monies. Wait, shoot. Where are the other places? I can't remember now. Uh. Cloud gaming could be an option to consider. Yeah. Oh. Here it is. I knew it was near here. 
Now, I can't really remember where the final one is. I think it's at the beginning of the chapter. So that just opens this. Okay. No cloud gaming has been tried and failed. Google has the failed experiment. Hmm. Uh, oh. Where is the last one? Google is Google. I don't think they know enough to make proper glass. Maybe the next thing if I really remember Shasta's computer specs. Yeah, pro possibly. I can't. I don't know what my specs are. I just live here. Uh. Where is the third one? Kenny, I'm calling for you. Where is the third guy? There are three things. I've got two of them. But I don't remember where the third one was. For which quest? Um, well, I'm trying to find, oh, and I'm getting a tackled. So these altars, um, oh, did it disappear after I put it in? Oh no, this. So I've done two of these, but there's one more and I can't remember where it is. Because I did the one to open to the boss room. And then I just did that one that just is like a secret. I'm missing two. And I'm missing these. Is that time by cuties? Bye, Servando. Thanks for hanging out. It's good to have you. Yeah, I'm just... Here, I'll go. Here, let me look. Go to the shrine where you fought the desert guy. The desert guy? Huh? Who's the desert guy? The desert guy? Looking for a secret boss? Yeah, I'm working on it. I'm having my partner. The one who slashes. The one who slashes? I fought too many bosses today. Hold up. <laughs> You're talking about the this one? Or are you talking about that one? The one with the big ass guitar. Oh, the temple? The big ass katana. You got his spirit. <laughs> this is why I'm so bad at being sack beaded. Let me look. The big ass katana. Uh, are you talking about this guy? The guy on the bridge? You're talking about the guy on the bridge. Okay. That guy, okay. Um, uh, 
Uh, who is fastest? Let's go here. <laughs> okay. Go to the shrine you fought the desert guy. I think this is it. And that closest to him then into the nearby village. Not that one. <laughs> yeah, I did. I haven't fought Black l long. I just tried a couple times and then I left because I wasn't ready yet. So Sandgate Village. That feels too far. Yeah, no. the him and then into the nearby village let me log into the game no <laughs> you don't need to do that i can find it See, I don't do well with it. Not because... Because I'm just bad at it. Okay. I'll find it. Surely. Yeah, and then we go through here. We're going on a journey. A journey to the west. Wait, what? This isn't it. I am directionally challenged. Yeah, what's nice about the dragon bosses, the long bosses, is that they literally tell you where they are because they are yapping. Ow! Let me go in. I'm gonna get ambushed. Oh no, I killed him. Do, 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 do. They're back at the temple. I love this part where you come up to the temple and all the birds fly away. Lit. Uh... Do you remember fighting three rats? I fought a lot of rats at the same time. Yeah. I'm going to that place right now. I remember those guys. Ah. I'm going there right now. Yeah, that's the spot. Okay. This spot. Oh, right before the door.
died before the door? What? This isn't where what I was thinking about, but yeah, sure. Oh. Oh. This poor child. <gasps> no. Um, I wasn't talking about the well child, but I will take it. I was talking about something else. Sit over by... I think I just remembered where it might be. So, I, what are you looking for? I said I was looking for... You know how in order to open up the boss door, you have to... The main boss door of chapter. You have to put the talisman into the thing. To like the statue. There's three of them and I've only found two. I was just trying to find the third one. <clears throat> There's three? Yes. Show me the door. What? Yeah, there's three. One, two. Oh, is it just these two? I used them though. Why do I still have them? Oh, there is no third one. All you need is two. Oh, you keep them. Oh, I thought they would disappear once I used them. Well, shit. All right. Well, cool. What's this? Emotions of child are certainly born from the touch of experience. Once hidden inside the Buddha's head, this treasure has a secret yet to be revealed. Oh, that's cute. That's wonderful. I don't remember when I got that. Okay, Kenny, where is... the next well child? I actually don't know where the well would be. Haven't fought Mad Tiger yet? No. I mean, I fought a mad tiger where you saw the horse guy. Okay, in the rat village. Oh, I'm already here. Wait. Yeah. Yes, okay. You fought a Mercedes to get into a parking spot today. It's random. Whoa. Hey, I've never seen that before. Hold up. I swear to God, I I even saw his shoulders. Hold on a second. They park bad and I still park next to them in my Jeep? Hey, listen, if they park bad, that's their own fault. It's not your job to cater to their bad parking. I never do. A little 
mushroom head. Okay. Okay, what is this? I actually don't know if I've seen this. Oh! That looks like a boss. -a? That looks like a boss. No, it's not. You're just annoying. I just saved myself. Okay, I actually haven't been over here. Oh, this is above the where I fought the frog. Can I get in this water? Gross. Little frog guys. Ow, did I just Oh yeah, that's right. The frogs explode when they die, right? Ow. <laughs> the game's eyes are the idea for exploding frogs? No. Uh. Oh, yeah. There's another area. What the hell? Dude, this game is ginormous. I came over here at least. Yeah, this doesn't look familiar. Just gotta keep going. What is this? Lambrew. Ooh, is backseating allowed? Uh, I prefer no. Um, I kind of just ask Cootherton, my mod, uh, for help when I need it. But I prefer to keep it minimal. Because I'm... I'm kind of dumb. <laughs> and I have a hard time with instructions. <laughs> Mostly. TBH, it's a skill issue. Okay, cool. I actually never came over here. Okay, but now let's see. Go to the area where you saw the horse guy. Okay, well, I'm making a detour right now, but I gotta go back to horse guy. Yeah, thanks for asking. I do appreciate it. I am the exception. <laughs> My spouse is the only exception right now. And if he g gets on my nerves, then he hears about it later. He doesn't get on my nerves. Okay, I think I got everything over here. I try, but I, I try, but fail at it. <laughs> uh, yeah, Chef tries to troll me. Okay, so the place where we fought the Earth Wolf. Where was the Earth Wolf? It's been a while since we've been over here. So now I gotta re-remember. Oh, 
You have trolling to come. It's not your trip, trip, trip. Oh, I've made it. Where the horse was. What? There's no, oh. Oh, I got a scene. Oh, so this tiger isn't dead? Oh, I followed you. <gasps> oh, I see. So it's a different tiger. I see. So, he was friends with this tiger. I thought the tiger in the well was Tony. It's a different tiger. That the guy was feeding people to. Yikes. He's still trapped here? Thank you, Kenny. Thank you. Tony the Tiger ate Frosted Flakes? No, he eats blood. He's naked! Tony's brother, maybe? I think so. He's nude! He's not wearing any clothes! Okay. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Pants are overrated. No, he's got fur. Wow, one shot. Yeah. <laughs> Have a good stream. Have a good one. <laughs> I'm leaving you there. <laughs> Have a good one, Gus. It's good to see you. Thanks for hanging out. Sleep well. Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams. Okay, let's try that again. Ugh. Oh, you have a similar move to your bro. Hi, yeah, yeah. No, I'm so dead. Oh. What? I had one HP. <laughs> I had one HP. <laughs> I was, uh, huh? How was I alive? That was weird. That was one HP in a dream. Holy, he hits like a bus. He hits like a bus. I want that. <sighs> True, I did. I died. I got the shit kicked out of me. Okay. Dude! 
dude, his combos are a gazillion years long. in the middle of healing. Ah! Nope, that's a grab attack. Hit him in the peen. Dig in your mash? What does that mean? Okay. Bro, this boss is hard. And now all I have is like hard bosses. This fight is a PC crasher because of the water and the fur. True. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> Get him. Ah. Get him. Roar killed me. <laughs> he yelled at me. Get him, boys. Oop. Yeah, rip. Hi, Derek. How are you doing? Welcome in. Happy Saturday. Hi. I, it's like all hard bosses right now. They're scary. Hi, voice of an angel. <laughs> Thanks, Derek. <laughs> I dodged! I'm dead. <laughs> Bro, what the hell? This boss is mean. His opening combo is rude. Tooth, wait, did you change your name? He got his original name back. He got his original name back. Now I have to call you Kuth instead of Kuth. I mean, you can call him Kuth. Ares is still gonna call him Kuth. Ah. Either 
works. Yeah, any of Kenny doesn't mind. Yeah, Kenny, it is. Yeah, Kuthi Poopy for life. Yeah, ah, oh, Kuthi Poopy. Kuthi, how's Cat doing in this game? <laughs> yeah, Kenny, how am I doing? She's throwing. What? Hey! I'm throwing? Give her a grade. Oh, okay. A minus for throwing. Trying to throw on purpose. I'm not throwing on purpose. Ah. Ah, he's the pin. What the hell? <laughs> Brutal. <laughs> She's actually killing it. I am trying my best. This boss is harder than Tony the Tiger. I have to like pick between like two really hard bosses right now. Tony the Tiger DLC boss. neck hurts. Yikes. <laughs> Not the midair freeze. That's the worst. <laughs> Bro, he's so violent. <laughs> Has this been the toughest boss for you in this game? Um, so far... He is definitely kicking my butt. I think the hardest one so far that I've beaten was Tony. The blood pool guy. I kind of got stuck on him, but not for too long. This guy is rough, though. I forgot he has one more follow-up. You hear all those little chimes? Yikes. I got my little... I got my little parry.
dude, he's kicking my butt. <laughs> he is destroying me. This guy is rough. Hmm. Not as far as this. I just beat po po Blood Pool Tiger Guy. I'm taking a break to focus on Elden Ring. Oh, yeah. Focus on Elden Ring. Elden Ring brain raw forever. <laughs> I keep forgetting that has one more follow-up. The parry! The parry! I messed up. So scary. Yeah, smash, become rock. Yeah, become rock. Yeah. so hard <laughs> i can do it who's how's your second playthrough going the flight school elden ring is fun <laughs> ah that was a good run too yeah it was i don't have the he pulls up the ground and i don't have the timing one two mm, two uh. yep yikes Let me heal. Nice. go. Ah! Whew. I am mash get the get I am rock smash Rock smash, rock smash. Rock smash. Yeah. 
dodge, bro. Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> I was so close. <laughs> I dodged. <gasps> yeah, Kenny got a new PC. Hello, Wuhas. Howdy, y'all. How are you? I'm gonna... I'm gonna win now. What? I... 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 Hello? in the butt. This is not the one. I'm dead. <laughs> the the tiger, rar. This tiger was tough. Yeah, he's a tough one. He is very volatile. I'm have a feeling you're getting into streamer brain. You don't know me. <laughs> I am not. <laughs> Struggles on boss for more than 20 minutes equals streamer brain. What? Ah, oh, I dodged too early. Chef I writer thing that pop I almost said that popcorn that rock hit me on the head <laughs> almost said that popcorn hit me on the head and get your popcorn <laughs> watch out for a rock <laughs> not for popcorn bro he had the he has so many moves I'm quite impressed with how many moves bosses have What? Oh, yikes. I move. Uh. What?
I like this song a lot. He's gonna rip my head off. Holy. Ah it's over. Ah, it's over. <laughs> oh, this boss is uh, brutal. Uh, <laughs> trying to like time certain things is brutal. Okay. So I have that move, at least. Ah, that's the one that, okay. Was off again. Okay, it's fine. You shithead. So hyper focused on he's beat him up. Beat them up. It is time. That's right. Ah, shit, man. That's brutal. Okay. His second phase is so brutal. I'm just trying to use like all my spells in it. Use spells. I need to, you know what? I need to wait. I need to wait till he's to like half health. And then I can like beat him into the ground. <laughs> what? Please, I dodged, I swear. Hey, yeah. Hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him.
though. so rough <sighs> okay <sighs> you got this thank you Right. I was a little late. I'm a rock. When I'm a rock. Yeah. job me let's go i did it <laughs> thanks cute thanks pomegranate oh oh my heart is racing i almost threw at the end i won't lie thank you aries let me wait stop jumping on it open it there we go poor cat just wants some company at the bottom of the well yeah company Wants a personal restaurant. He was just lonely. Why did he just climb out, forehead? <laughs> just climb out, forehead. Plague bane gourd. Take it. Am 
A tiger. Always a spirit, really. Ew, what's that? Gross. Oh, there's a little more. Nope, is this it? Cool. <gasps> we did it! Ready for the next secret? <sighs> yeah. Yeah, I have... So I have black lung um, to go to as well, but I'm ready for this one. So tell me where we're going. I... I... Uh, yeah. Hmm. Go back to where you first met the boar. Okay. I can do that. I remember that. I can't remember which one. <laughs> we'll just guess. We'll just guess. Holy shit, it's almost 10. Rock crest, lol. Rock crest. Well, that would have been helpful. Rock crest. Thanks. <laughs> That has a helpful. <laughs> I don't remember where I came from. Okay. We run. Trying to play dirty. Ow! Ow! This is why he has such beautiful nails. Time for rock. You come rock. You come rock. Ah. Hit me. Hit me, you loser. What are you good for?
Okay. Oh, I have no more mana. Ah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, get him, boys. Get him, boys. Ow! No! <laughs> Dang it! I died. I said to get him, and they did, and then I threw. That, I threw. That was a throw. He's not very hard. He's just throwing sand in my face. He just hits hard. So he's wondering why I have his brother's crest? What did I do? I literally fed you a meal. I literally fed you a meal, bro. So rude. Hopped his brother sober up and he's upset. And then apparently, hey! I am not doing super well on this one. Yeah, hit me. There he goes. I can hold that. I didn't realize I can hold it. Yeah. <gasps> I'm dead, by the way. should do that. Yeah! I did it! <laughs> oh, you had fun? Okay. Oh. Oh, can I maybe go inside now? Okay. Oh, sick. Is it gonna let, oh snout mask? Ooh, is it gonna let me in now? Oh, go in! Oh, yes, now it will let me go in. <gasps> yes.
今人不见古十月，今月从京照古人。你看，黄金之国也好，落日之国也罢，都已不复存在。传说这里的茫茫沙海之中，曾蛰伏着一只上古巨虫。这巨虫平日里沉睡地底，无踪可寻；一旦醒了，便会钻出来吞噬人畜。偏偏它外壳坚若磐石，寻常刀斧弓弩难以穿透，往来商旅不敢靠近，周边小国更是苦不堪言。是逢一只黄毛貂属下界途经此地。感应到那巨虫身上似有无上佛力，于是施法镇住巨虫，收为己用。小国国王大喜，将鼠妖奉为护国神圣，更为他建庙塑像，世代供奉。鼠妖图修炼方便，干脆留了下来。后来。鼠妖神功出城，掳走了唐僧，与孙悟空激战于黄风岭，一时风沙蔽日，日月无光。那鼠妖的神风着实厉害，若非灵吉菩萨出手，怕是真经难取。只是，没了鼠妖坐镇，古国自是难逃覆灭的劫数。而原本水秀山清的黄风岭，也变成了今天这般模样。哦，哦<笑> ，I'm so excited about this like cedar boss because I've I've seen it and it's really fun. It's really fun. The drunk said, "There's gold here. Do you believe him? I do. I believe." Monkey. It's like, well, I think I will read the lore of the bosses we beat, and then I will call it here, because I'm I'm starting to feel a little. My eyes are starting to get tired, but I want to read the lore. It's important, chat. We. Are killing it. Yeah, we got the mad tiger. <laughs> Yellow wind invades the land, brothers turn to strife. Father's vengeance left unclaimed in the well of life. Roaring through the mountain pass, a heart that faints to care. Actions always half complete, dreams and lithe life laid bare. One day, the brother of Tiger Vanguard was practicing his roaring technique at the bottom of the well when he saw someone climbing down the vines. Seeing that the intruder had some courage, he refrained from attacking and instead inquired about his purpose. He was practicing his roars. Well, I guess they did hurt. The man explained that he was seeking a bodhis, bodhisattva to cure his son's wind illness. But he failed, and now his son was on the brink of death. Hearing this, Tiger Brother devised a plan. He attributed his elder brother's deeds to himself and convinced the man to bring his son, claiming he could treat the boy. Oh, so he pretended to be his brother. Okay. When they first met, the boy's face was pale, too weak to climb down the well by himself. The boy was carried by his father by tying him with a hemp rope to lower him safely into the well. Tiger brother examined the boy and confirmed that his spirit had been disturbed by the Samadhi wind. Without stopping the wind and sand, no one could hear him. Tiger brother remembered that his brother had given him a magical gourd. Drinking from it could strengthen one's vitality, and he thought it might keep the boy alive. Oh. After the boy drank the water Tiger Brother gave him, he indeed regained some energy and could speak. Despite his long illness, the boy was very polite. He thanked Tiger Brother for his help, praising him endlessly. In the boy's admiring gaze, Tiger Brother found a long-lost sense of satisfaction. He instructed the father and the son to come daily to take a sip from the gourd, or the boy would relapse. After several visits, the boy's condition improved significantly. He could walk around and even play in the village, making many friends. Each time he came to drink from the gourd, he would call Tiger Brother Tiger God and share his new food, toys, and experiences. 
Despite his initial wariness of the father and son, Tiger Brother gave the boy his gourd, and when he observed that the man was sincere and honest, he instructed the boy to keep the gourd close. Hating his words, the boy's health improved even more. Yet, abruptly, the father and son stopped visiting. Tiger Brother waited for several days, thinking they may have run off with the gourd. Determined to find out what happened, he went to the village. Upon entering the village, he saw blood everywhere. The villagers had been slaughtered. At the village entrance, there was a thin coffin, and inside lay the boy's body. He still wore the gourd Tiger Brother had given him around his neck. Judging by the wounds, it seemed he had been beaten to death with sticks. <gasps> oh, the Tiger Brother carried the coffin back to the bottom of the well. He decided to wait until he was strong enough. One day, he would stop that cursed wind and sand. Wait, so he wasn't eating people down there? So... Why? What? So was he feeding the villagers? He loved that little boy. So the same story told from two points of view. So he saw himself as a kind person and he loved the little boy. But the father was feeding villagers to the tiger and so they beat him to death. The son to death. And then he killed everyone. Ah, this story is going to make me cry. I don't like that. That's so sad. And he was trying to become strong so he could kill the rat. Because the rat is like the reason why the winds are happening. Yeah, this story is so sad. I don't like it. <laughs> it's gonna make me cry. Zudong. Oh, got it. It's so sad. Why? <laughs> that makes me so sad. The yellow robed squire. Ah. I can read. I want to read this one too. I'm curious about him too. In silken robes that flutter bright, a long static guy with eyes alight. Drunk with joy, he sleeps on tombs forlorn. His spirit and armor gleam like dawn. Different type of poem. <laughs> Windy, searing sun, a vast waste. The headless monk and a yellow robe squire rested together under a withered tree. The monk plucked at the strings of his sanxian, his body swaying gently to and fro. Enough, said the squire, rousing himself. Let's have some peace. The monk's hand stilled. He edged away, then raised his hand to strum again. The squire hastily let out his drinking flask. Have a drink? With what mouth? I ain't got no head. Where is it? Didn't you hear the song? The monk answered himself. Gone! Someone stole it. You should have kept better watch on your head. The fault is your own. The monk turned away, making no answer. The squire drew a piece of gold from his robe and showed it to the monk. Though he had neither head nor eye, the monk warned, Mind how ye swing about such a prize, but have the thieves eye eyeing, eyeing ye. The squire waved a hand. I don't have to worry. I'll come for you if it's filch. Me? You're the only one I've shown it to. If it's gone, you'll be the culprit. The monk gave a dry chuckle at a loss for words. The squire gestured toward the horizon. There's gold aplenty there. Why should you covet a mere sheep from me? I ain't after your gold, but tell me, what gold lies there? You truly don't know? There, that was once a kingdom abundant with gold. Gold from the gilded Buddha statues, all stripped bare. Even the gold on Buddha statues. You ain't a believer in karma, then? Ha! All those golden Buddhas never brought them any favor. It is plain. There is no such thing as karma. The monk fell silent. The squire sneered, tipping his flask. He found it empty and then rose to his feet. I'm to await someone at the bidding of my brother. If you want more drink, come find me. He tucked the flask on his side. I'll go scrape off more gold and trade it for a better brew. Then we can drink our fill. The monk tried to stop him, so he played the Sanxian, singing a song of karmic justice. The squire paid him no mind. With a wave and a laugh, he strode away across the sand. The headless monk's heart weighed down with disquiet. The yellow-robed squire, however, went on his way, and the desert air rang long with the peals of his laughter. Greedy. He's a greedy man. I love that. Da -da 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 -da. I can't wait to hear the music again. Alright, chat. I think we're gonna call it here. I 
maybe we finish chapter two on Monday, question mark? Maybe. We got some tough bosses ahead of us. We got another dragon boy. He was scary. Uh, good stream. You could press quite a bit. GG's good job. Oh my god, y'all are so... Y'all are so kind to me. Thank you so much. I had a lot of fun. I'm having a great time with this game. Thank you. Pomegranate Chef, Kuzutin, Aries. You guys are sweet. <laughs> okay. Let's find someone to raid. Let's see. Who is around? I like this song. <gasps> it's Kern. It's Kern Stream Anniversary Part Two. We're gonna go raid her. She's playing Star Wars Outlaws. Kern is such a wonderful queen, and we love her so much. We're just gonna say that. Yeah, we're gonna go to Kern. We love Kern here. She's so wonderful. She's such a queen. Let's get that. Let's do that. And we'll be back on Monday with more, of course. Thank you guys so much for being here. Y'all are super lovely. And yeah, I can't really think of anything else. I had a lot of fun today. Good bosses, good difficult bosses, huge progress. I'm very, very proud. So have a good night, everyone. And we'll see you on Monday.